Timberborn. Now this is a sponsor segment. Timberborn, a mechanistry, they develop a publisher, um, reached out and asked if I wanted to stream this for its release. And the release is now, two minutes ago, actually. So Timberborn, who knows it already? Who's played the demo, maybe? Because there's been a demo. New game. This is Timberborn. A post-apocalyptic survival city builder with beavers. They look cute. This is the early access release and they've changed a couple of things. For example, a new UI. It was overhauled. It looks nice. Look at the beavers. They're so cute. Um, other things as well. You can now also play... <laughs> you can now also play the Iron Teeth. The second class, it's just that we need to unlock it. So we need to reach an average well-being of eight while playing the Folk Tales. Those ones. But yes, if you want to know something about the game, please ask me. I've got notes here so that I hopefully can answer all your questions. Um, and if you're interested in the game, exclamation mark, this is. It, it is available on Steam, on Epic and on GOG. I'm not sure if it's going to be on the Nexus store or the Humble store. Dab, if you could maybe check that, that'd be amazing. Is it cute? It is very cute. Yes, it is very cute. Hi, I'm Tooth. Hello. You played the demo, me too. I played the demo as well. Is it Folktales? <clears throat> Easy going, but hardworking. Folktales are expert farmers. They respect nature and it rewards them with plentiful bounties. Their motto, comfort, food and sturdy wood. Okay, planes. We're just going to start with a recommended thingy. It would be nice to get the eight. Or was it well-being? Unlock the iron teeth and the look of the iron teeth. Hi, Fagan. Hello. Lex, good to see you. Game mode normal. Easy, normal, hard, custom. Normal is settlement starts with moderate resources. I want a challenge, apparently. And droughts are milder at the beginning, but intensify over time. That's that's totally all right. If we go to custom, you can customize everything, basically. Thank you for checking, Dab. That's great. Thank you. What they added, right. So, uh, the two playable factions, because previously you could only play the folktales, right? Um, they're now districts. I'm just going through the list, right? And the, and the super new thing is districts, and you can have trade routes between those two districts, or more than two districts, actually. I don't have a buy command for this, but it is available on Steam, GOG, and the Epic Store. You can, you can type in this is, exclamation mark, this is, if you want to know more about the game. Let's go. Become beavers or beaver gods, really. Where did the music go? Well, how many factions races are there? Currently there's two, the folk tales and the iron teeth. But there will be more in the game eventually. Currently, there's two that you can play. Here we are. And if you've played the, the, the demo, you can already see the UI is nicer. It's more clean. It has a, you know, better look to it. I like what they did. I like the changes a lot. It is so much nicer. I'm hiding this. Can I move this? No. I'm hiding it. That's okay though. It's it's fine if I hide this. I'm I'm just gonna read it anyway. That's basically what we've got to do. Hi Likey, who could be cheese? Welcome, welcome. Yeah, there's no music during the loading screen, but that's okay. It looks quite different, I know, right? Hi Kremlin. It says release in 23 hours. It's supposed to release right now though, like seven minutes ago. It says it's been pushed back a day because Steam shows the release date on the 16th. Okay, FG is not the only one to say this. Let me check my emails and stuff. Uh, the game will minimize, I think. It minimizes for me. So... I did not get any information about this. Nowhere. Really. I have the... Here. Early access release, the 15th. That is today. Let me, let me uh, go to Steam. Oh, 
What do you know? That must be a... I mean, maybe they had a critical error or something. I'm not sure. Like, I'm, I'm sponsored to play this Someone's now sad. for the release, but you know what? I'm going to quickly shoot them an email and ask about it. Because email is the only way I, I can reach them. Uh, Someone subbed. Thank you. Just a second. Quick question. For a day on Steam. Is that on purpose? <clears throat> okay I shot them an email it's the only thing I can do my only way to reach them oh they're saying on Steam uh, on Discord that Steam has issues oh I see I see okay someone subbed so it should have released already but hey you know Sometimes Steam had issue has issues. I will try to keep an eye on my email thingy, but yeah, still, I'm supposed to play this now, so obviously I'm gonna do that. Lonesome Rider, um, Al Kirwins and Cherry, thank you very much for the Prime subs. Appreciate it. Hello. Fun with the emotes. Also, you saw a hit train. Of course, of course. It seems that it's broken. Sometimes Steam breaks, but we can still look at the game and check it out and. Uh, you can play through me, kind of, but, but hopefully soon Steam is going to fix the issue and then you can play it too. So, bear with me. I think there was UI scaling. And now that I read the font, we might need a bit of UI scaling. How's this? 110%. What every new settlement needs are logs. Because Woohoo! gift subs for everyone. For beavers. We need logs to build things. Of course, I'm not the first to know, but hey, it's fine. People can ask me questions. That's okay. If I can't answer them, then maybe I have a contact and I do have a contact. So I've asked them, but I'm pretty sure he's very busy right now. But hey, let's let's wait, okay? How much is this going to be on Steam? It's going to be... I need to click out of the game for that. Sorry. It will be $24.99. But with regional pricing, so I don't know what your currency is. But let's say $25 and then it's going to be converted into your into your currency. True Barbari, thank you very much for the five gift subs. Appreciate the support, thank you. Thank you for gifting to What the Flux, Kroon, Dark Omen, Ansev and Kinbats. Thank you, thank you. I'm playing on Steam, yes. No, no, Beaver with me, I'm sorry, of, of course, Beaver with me, please. Yes. Hello, Nick. <laughs> no, I said dollars, as in US dollars. And then it's going to be converted, so... Uh, it's probably 20 euros. Build lumberjack flags and mark some trees in his range for cutting. All buildings used by beavers must be connected to a district center with a path, so connect the two as well. So yeah, this is what I have to do. It's hidden behind the camera. That's okay, though. It's, it's going to be way much, uh, like, way more than 10 euros, though. Oh, lumber. Plant trees and bushes. No. Storage. Labor. Calling post, builder's hut, distribution post, drop-off point. Housing, water, food, wood. A lumberjack flag. Is there any water in here? Oh, yeah, it is. We can rotate with R. Um, I really like the graphics overhaul that they've done. This looks very nice. I'm just going to put this here. Then we need a path. That's going to be difficult for me because I, I'm very good at forgetting about paths and then not building them. Wow, okay, yes. Hydra Hammer Time, hello. 
Uh, not not every city builder, not every survival city builder is a banished game. There have been city builders before banished was even a thing, right? So this is a post-apocalyptic survival city builder with beavers. Really cool. Your population are beavers. They're super sweet. They're so cute. They just tweet about the problem. Got it. Got it, got it. I know, it feels, it feels way more finished, right? Absolutely. I mean, before it was a demo, of course, you know, they're going to change it. I'm glad they did. How are you guys? Okay, there is that, the, the lumberjack flag. I actually need to make two. Okay. So I want to get one here. This is not quite in range. Maybe I'll just get another one right there. So I need a path. Good. Mark the trees for cutting. Oops. That's that's not quite. What an cut. unbelievable game. I can scarcely be relieved it's at now. How has your day been, Carrie? It's great to be at home after a long day at work. The patients really beavered me today. They beavered you? They beavered you? Very nice, Nick. Thank you for the 100 bits. I know, it's been... It's been... I don't know, I'm gonna say alpha for a while now, right? We played the demo a while back. It was available during lots of Steam festivals. But now... Oh, like, soon then. I clicked something and it's blue. Yeah, so, so this is, you know, water water now. If you go in the build menu, then you... you you get this. So probably that the water doesn't distract you, right? I've marked... I've marked... I want to... Okay, just a second. That sound... UI volume. Oh yeah, that's better. Cut trees. I didn't see this. Mark tree cutting area. Good. And then also everything here. Okay, I've done the thing. Those are the beavers. Oh, you can still glitch through the through the ground. Ah. Ah. <laughs> can we build a temple for the beavers to idolize the chair? I don't know right now if there is religion. I know there is science. Leisure. There's the campfire, yes, the rooftop terrace, the temple. We can make a temple, yes. We can just pretend that they worship the chair. So, yeah. <laughs> All right. The game has released on Steam. Thank you. Perfect. All right. So, they've overcome their issues. It is now available on Steam, on GOG, on Epic. Um, have a look. Have a look. Check it out. Why are the buildings made out of wood? Because we're beavers. Oh, I need to click continue here. Now we need to keep our beavers alive. Yes. Yes, that's quite true. I'm going to pause here. Um, build a water pump on a riverbank to secure a steady supply of water. You should also place a gatherer flag to gather berries from nearby bushes. I will do so. Food. Gatherer flag. I'm going to put this here. Then do I need to say... Cut trees, plant crops. Are you going to grab those bushes without me telling you to? Telling you to? Let's see. And the water pump. There's a water dump as well. That is new. Wait, here this way. I want to try to build differently than I've played in the demos. So... Okay, if I play differently... I'm going to put the water pump here this time around. And I need a path. Okay, so we're going to build this. And then I want a log pile. It makes sense to have that next to where we cut the trees, right? I'm going to put this here. Good. 
Ten percent off right now. Perfect. So if you if your euro is your currency, it's eighteen ninety. Basically eighteen ninety. It's the same map as the demo. It is the same map as the demo, so far at least, for, from what I can tell here, yes. Um, but I pick this. So this is the recommended map. There's loads more though. I chose the first Bieber class, the Folktales, because this is the one you've got to start with. We need to reach eight well-being in order to unlock the next one. This is the well-being. Um, and then I just chose the recommended map because I thought, you know, the quicker we're, we're doing this, uh, the sooner I can move on to the Iron Teeth. All right. Well, Felsan, it's it's actually ten cents cheaper on Steam. So there are the different maps they can play. Also, I got an email. And I'm going to check that out on my phone now, so I don't minimize the game again. Yeah, so it was a bug with Steam, the game is available. But we already know that. They got back to me super quickly though, perfect. We're waiting for the water pump to be built. What is this? Materials, nothing, right. Wood. And then we also need a water tank. I want to get this rather close -ish to where we've got the water pump. Maybe right there, but can I tell you to... Can I tell you to prioritize this? Yes, I can. Oh, this looks so much nicer than before. I really like this. Do we have a list of beavers? Homeless beavers. Yes, yeah, so I remember that I can click on each individual beaver and then name them. But there's not really a list of beavers. Hmm, okay. Oh, I see Dav, so it's the same then. Okay. Are the iron teeth similar to the iron board from Game of Thrones? <laughs> um, well, well. So the folktales are really good with, with farming and getting food. The Iron Teeth have special buildings and special, so special architecture and special buildings. Um, and they're more focused on tech, I think. So, yeah. Can you be a dentist? You're going to make a fortune in our beaver town here. If you are a dentist. Okay, so we have a water pump now. And workers are assigned automatically, so I don't really have to do anything here. While all of the buildings you place have some storage, they will fill up quickly. Build a log pile to store logs. Already done. A small water tank in the making. And a small warehouse to store berries. Oh yeah, and you do gather berries without me telling you to. Small warehouse. Maybe right here, where we get the berries from. Also, cool thing about this game is you can actually build vertically. So, with most buildings, you can just stack them. And then you can also make, make stairs and bridges and balconies, and it's really cool. I can name the beavers, yes. The thing is, I don't really have a list, so I need to click on each individual beaver. Which is a bit... It's a bit difficult. The music is very quiet in game now. Let's see if we can we can make this louder. I'm gonna try it like this. Maybe make this slightly loud again. Good. We're waiting for stuff to be done. I have eight logs right now. Eleven homeless beavers. That's okay. They all die, and and they do they do die all the time. Yes, that is true. District 1. Oh, I can rename the districts, though. So, what shall we name it? We need something... something witty. I want a beaver pun, please. I'm sure you can think of something. A beaver pun for the district name. 
Now the music is too loud. Okay, let's try it like this. It is in night now. Is that the elevation level? Working hours. Holy. Oh no, there are 16 working hours. A day. I'm so sorry. We can also hide the water here. Forecast unknown. Okay. Knowing neighborhood. Damn mask. <laughs> I don't like to be the dams. Oh, so in the beginning, you start out with just wooden dams. I'm not sure if you can make hydroelectric ones. So they are sleeping. They are breathing. Yes, thank you. I mean, you kind of look uh, staked here, but um, previously in the demo, when the beavers were sleeping, they were not animated, so they looked dead. I'm glad they breathe now because that, that was always a bit sad to watch. <laughs> Beaverly Hills. Your Beaverly Hills is perfect. Who came up with that? Who? Regger. Amazing. I like it. Beaverly Hills it is. Oh, this, this is why I let you choose, because I just wouldn't know what to pick. Oops. Yeah, that one is on a stakeout, right? Um, <clears throat> Ouch. Okay, let's speed up during the night. So we don't really have, you know... Then we want to demolish this. There's a barrier here, so we want to fill this with water as well. A stake in. But it's outside. Isn't it? <laughs> Good. Hi, Savage Sleep. How are you? Here's our tank. We're just waiting for the warehouse now here. Good. We do have a bit of berries. The next is probably going to be a farm, right? Employees farmers. Or we should get recreation. What, what do we need to get here? Social life, fun, nutrition, comfort. Okay. It is it is in the beaver, yes. Okay. Okay. They use tools. Let's see. Well, no. You don't really see them gnawing, you know, on the tree, but it's, it's basically what it comes down, down to. They don't use tools. At least not for getting the trees. For building, for constructing. Is there an animation for that? Wait a second, do I actually have builders? District center. Builders hut. Oh, I need I need science points for this, never mind. Yeah, there's there's no really not really a building animation. No all in. <laughs> Great. Oh, Uris Mimes, I've played this a lot already. Thank you. No need to backseat. The beavers should now survive for a while. You can start thinking about building farms, producing power, and generating science points. Good luck. That was the tutorial. It's, it's very basic, but that's okay. So I'm going to go for a farm next. And I'm going to build this close to the river. Um... Maybe actually here. Because we're going to have this. Are we going to have this here? Yes. And then we're going to plant crops. Carrots. For hunger nutrition. Days to grow four. And we get four, uh, three carrots. There's also potatoes. Six days to grow, but we only get one potato. Or wheat. We're definitely going to go for carrots. Okay. They just look when they build. Yeah, but keep in mind it's early access, right? So all of that might change still. 
I'm not sure how big the field should be. Two, four, two, four, six, eight. Four by eight. Let's go for this now. Beavers will do this. And then for science, the inventor. I could stack this up here already, but I don't have stairs yet. I need science for that. So the science thingy has to go on the ground. The inventor. Okay, here's your door. Am I going to put the inventor here in the back? I would love to put it up the hill. I think that would make so much sense roleplay wise because the, the inventor is always a, a like, I don't know, mad scientist up on a hill, separate from civilization, really. I know, they're all homeless. I'm, I'm aware. I bet. Beavers do live in huts. Yes, not mine, though. So they're lodges and mirrored lodges. So a lodge would look like... Would look like this. With a door on the right side. The mirrored one has it on the left side. Um... If we build lodges, then yes, the beavers will live there and they will also produce baby beavers. Which is a good thing because that means eventually you'll have more workforce. On the other hand, you also need to feed them. So that might be a bit tricky. So first, I'm going to make sure that we have food ready. Not just the berries, but also that we're planting food. And then I'm going to give them a house. Yes. Hi, Gortek. Yes, you can stack buildings. You can build vertically in this game. Um, you need you need science first. Do I actually, I probably need to click on the inventor once it's done. But uh, you see this this red padlock symbol. Those are all the things that you can research eventually with science, and. You could get wooden stairs and then platforms and higher platforms and even higher platforms. And then you can stack those buildings together and you can make... You can make balcony pathways and bridges. It's really cool. It's really, really nice. And you start eating the trees, but do you, do you not want something else every once in a while? You don't want to eat the same thing. Day in and day out. The, the baby years. Yeah, no, I can't. I can't put those two words together. <laughs> Hello, Wim. Happy Wednesday. Hi, hi. Exactly, Gobi. Exactly. It's just, it's just family planning, right? So, I want you to focus on the farmhouse, please. Aloha, Miss Carrie Tong. Hello, Gotik. Hello. Thank you very much for the Prime Gaming. Appreciate the support. Thank you for three months. Welcome back. It is also city planning, yes. I've got two workers there. Yes. Oh, is this done already? It is done now. Yes. And they are farming. Very good. So now we're going to build the inventor's hut. Homeless. Okay, but I don't have any unemployed people. So what we're going to do, they've planted this, which means I don't need workers here right now. So I've unassigned one of them. You can go somewhere else. In the meantime, we could start with housing. Maybe we wanna... Our water tank is full. We could... I don't really know yet how I'm gonna... how I'm gonna do this. Three beavers can live in a in a house. We're gonna start with two houses here. We're growing food already. Here we have the inventor. But yeah, of course, I don't see a tech tree. We just accumulate science and knowledge and then we spend it here in the build menu. Of course. So so that's gonna happen. Perfect. Is it just building a civilization? Do you have to defend it as well? You don't have to defend it, but it is a survival game. So 
currently... Here, if I zoom out, you can see it better. Everything is dry, except for where the river is. So, eventually you grow and grow and grow, but then you don't have fertile soil anymore. So you do need irrigation, or you do need to move the way of the river, which you can do with dynamite later on. But also, uh, currently it's a normal season, but then there will be dry seasons where the river dries out. So you need to be prepared by building dams, for example. If you don't have that, if you don't have enough water stored, you're gonna die. So you don't have to defend right now and actually fight a war against anybody, but you do need to make sure they've got enough resources to survive the dry seasons. The music is quite relaxing, yeah. No, I agree. Okay, well, building houses. What about landscaping? There is a dam. Blocks water, but allows some to pass through a spillway at the top. Good. We need this. And we need this here. Very good. There is another faction, yes, but you need to unlock it first. We need aid well-being with first faction, the, the folk tales, to unlock the iron teeth. So you start with three well-being already, and now we're gonna work on getting getting more. Hi, Staro. Good morning. Hello, hello. An explosive combination. Oh, it is. What is this here? Oh, those are the settings, right? Monuments, decoration, leisure. We want a campfire. It must be built on the ground. Campfire is going to be just across the district center. I think that makes sense. So we still have five homeless beavers, which means we need two more homes. Let's put this here. And then... Where's the path gonna go? Maybe this way, I don't I don't know. We can rearrange this later, but you know, any point ready. Construction lacks material. We need more whoopsie, we need more trees. Are they gonna they're gonna do that? Plant trees and bushes, cut trees. Unmark the tree cutting area. Demolition. I need to mark tree stumps for demolition. Do I still get a, a log out of this? Is that just so that it would look nicer? No, it's just for looking nice. Okay. Well then, no. We have 24 signs by now. Or knowledge, really. So let's have a look what we're going to do. Can they plant trees? Eventually. Um, there is a forester that I can unlock. There's a lumber mill that requires power, though. So yeah, probably with the first 60 signs that we get, we should get a forester so that we can plant trees here. That would probably be a good idea. We're not building the dam yet. You need water, but you can just get it. Easy. And beavers around the campfire. Look at them. Look at them having fun, enjoying their evening together. After 16 hours of work. Um, uh, so yeah, eventually I can uh, replant trees with a forester. I'm not sure if they slowly... If they slowly, you know, replant themselves. I'm gonna say no right now. Because game. But, but we'll see. Also, beavers are growing up. Good. They slowly reseed, oh really? Okay. 
I didn't know if they were just, you know, small since day one or not. Hi, right earphone. Hello. Welcome. Thank you. I'm glad you like it. Appreciate you saying that. They do slowly regrow. Fair enough. We're just waiting for this. So maybe we do need a bigger field. Let's go. Plant some more carrots. They're just chilling here during the day. Shouldn't they work? Everybody has a home now, though. We have three unemployed. Okay, so you can go work here again. It's too far from builders. Yes, yes. So that's still a thing. They didn't change that. What is this, by the way? District center? District gate. I need to go there. <laughs> I'm not sure if this is gonna work out. Can you build this now? No, it's also too far away. So I need to place a path around here. Is this gonna work now? Yes. Okay. <laughs> so once those log or once those trees have been cut down, I'm gonna make a proper path over there. They do slowly recede from a tree beside it. If you clear cut the forest, it's dead. Of course. Of course. I will get, like in two days, probably, I'm going to get the the Forester. So they have comfort now. They want to have fun, nutrition, knowledge. What does that entail? Can only be satisfied by adults. Okay. This tree just grew. Your beavers are happier than ever. You have reached a new well-being high school. Five. Look at this. Okay, and we are building this. Beavers are on the way. I can order them to cut down individual trees, yes. But I've just... I set the whole area here to be cut down. So they will do that anyway. Same as with this here. We could do with another water tank. Okay, 48 science. Soon. Is all fulfilled by giving them mirrors to see themselves being cute? I don't think so. Probably not. Was that a requirement here? I don't know what it is. There's no explanation here. Thank you, Nexio. Thank you for being here as well. It's very kind of you to say that. I'm glad you like it here. Can I maybe have this open but still show the water? No. Well, that's okay. The monument, it could be a monument. Oh yeah, there we go. Satisfies all one within seven tiles. Two and three. You are absolutely right. That costs a lot of science though. 1,000. Could I get this already? No. Tomorrow though. Tomorrow we can get it. Are those carrots grown? It's watered and alive. <laughs> I'm glad it is. I think it is fully grown. So tomorrow we can harvest our carrots. Yeah, here we go. So that's going to help them with food as well. Very good. We're building the dam. Okay. So we're already at five. At five. Um, wow. Well-being. Here we go. Well-being. I'm slightly concerned about... Oh, wait. I've got 60 now. About the forest, but... Forest up. Plants trees. Yes. Plants trees and bushes. This is your area. I'm sure I can tell you where to plant. Um, Who built this here? 
I suppose I can put this here and then you get a path. All right. Focus on this, very important. We'll get the forester here and we do have two unemployed. So we're gonna have someone working there and then we can tell you to grow. Here we go, well-being six already. Birch, pine or maple. Also blueberries, but... Resources, one log. Nine days, one log. 12 days, two logs. 24 days, eight logs. We should get... We should get maple. Maybe a huge area for maple. And then a bit for... Let's just do this. Um, what's this? Batch. So I've got something quickly. Nine days. Maple syrup. I don't think we get syrup from this. I think we only get the logs. There are seasons. There are normal season. Well, there is a normal season and then there's dry season and then the river will dry out. This is why we're already starting to build a dam here because we need to preserve the water. If it's dry season, the river dries out, the grass will dry out. We won't be able to get any, any like we won't be able to plant any crops. We also won't be able to grow trees and obviously we're not going to have water. So there is dry season and normal season and you need to be prepared. Okay, Asian jumping worms. Okay, okay. The game is very lovely, it's, it's really nice. You can also build vertically, which I haven't done yet, but we'll get there soon. So, maple. Let's just build maple everywhere. I'd build grow maple everywhere. <laughs> we'll be fine, right? What's your range again? I don't know. Building's full, yes, but um, well, we are working on a new one. Twelve days. We're currently we're currently on day nine already, so it it is quick. But yeah, maybe that's gonna be birch, so that I've got something. That looks stupid now. More maple. Alright, let's see. 24 science again. It needs to be done, they just need to build this. Okay. You used to be at build giant giant trees in Minecraft. Of course. You've had this on your wish list for a while. How's it so far? Um, we've played it for about 40 minutes. Um, I've played the demo a lot though, but now what it looks nicer. Someone subbed. Boop. Hi OG, thank you very much for 35 a month. Hello. I hope you had a good day of streaming. Welcome, welcome. Thanks for the resub. There is a new UI, the graphics looks nicer, the, the beavers when they sleep they actually breathe now so you don't think they're dead, they've just fallen over. Um, their district, so they changed a couple of things, they added new things obviously as well. So far it's very nice. If, you, if you're interested in getting the game it's available on Steam, on GOG, on Epic. Early access. But yeah. I need planks. Of course I need planks. I'm aware. I'm not aware. Planks are the different things. I am not aware. Carry difficulty, we need planks. In order to get planks, we need a sawmill. Uh, in order to make that work, we need power. Lumber mill. Yes, yes, of course. That's all right. We're, we're building other important things. That's... <laughs> Carry difficulty once again. A sore throat, oh no. 
Oh no. Timberboard, I mean, it's it's fun so far. Yeah, absolutely. All right, power generation. The water wheel for 180 HP. HP is the power unit. Oh, horsepower is horsepower, isn't it? If we get a water wheel, usually I build this here. I think I will build it here again, just because it's easy that way. So yeah, I'm going to build a water wheel here. This is going to be our focus now. 50 logs. Holy. Holy. Of course I make things more exciting. It's scary difficulty, you know. You can research a building you don't have the prerequisites for. It's not really silly. You just need to read, right? I, I think I can read. Sometimes it doesn't work, but... You know, usually... Usually I can't read. Also, I've played this game before, and, and the funny thing is, this happens every time. Every single time. <laughs> but that's alright. If I build this here... I'd love to build it here, though, but stupid path. Stupid tree. I could build it here. Yeah, I would like that. And then we'd get power, straight power shaft. And then I need a turn. Maybe I'll immediately get the T crossing here. Okay. So we're gonna we're gonna get this stuff. Oh, damn me. The dry season is going to be here super quickly, and then I won't be ready for that. But hey, okay. I'm not going to demolish the tree. It's going to grow and give us logs. It's going to be a great tree. I'm going to set this to be replanted here. Can I hide the trees? Probably. That's fine. The graveyard next. So we just dump them in the water. <clears throat> right? Right. <laughs> Not maple syrup, but we're going to fill that with carrots. Uh, berries, although we've got almost all of them. And they take a while to grow. But, no! but water and carrots is basically what we're going to have for the dry season. Oh, it'll, it'll be alright. We'll get this super quickly. One that have dried out. The water. I have water tanks, though. And... I am building the dam. Unfortunately, it's not finished yet. But... We'll see. I'm sure we still have a couple more days, right? I'll be fine. Hello, Viper. Uh... It's just Early Access because it just came out as an Early Access game 15 minutes ago. So, yes. Previously, it was a demo. Now it is out as an Early Access game. So now you can actually purchase it and play it if you wanted to. But it's not, it's not finished. No. It got new content and it got a UI overhaul and just graphics overall overhaul in general. And yeah, well, we're here checking it out. Also, this is sponsored. Thank you, go Pete. We do have the, what's it? The water wheel now. And then we want to work on the, on the power shafts here. And also on the sawmill, lumber mill is what they call it. Then we can get planks, and then we can get the forester. Okay. Save the trees. I'm working on it, my row. We need it for now, but I will replant them. I'm just, you know, making sure that we can, actually. So. 
Can you stack all buildings on top of each other? Only specific type. The ground... Well, a building type needs, needs to be solid. And the game will tell you this. For the inventor's hut, for example, it's... No, wait. It was the camp. Oh, crap. I misplayed, guys. I misplayed so badly. Dry season in three days. <gasps> oh. Change of plans. Change of plans. This is probably not going to work, but we need to get this dam done as quickly as possible. I misplayed. Carry difficulty. It happens. Let's go, let's go, let's go. People, people. Go. I should have said beavers, not people, but beavers. It happens. Okay. Finally got rid of this. Ay ay ay. Demolish buildings and resources. Can I demolish a path? Delete buildings. Yes. All right. Oh no. We can do this, right? <clears throat> uh, I, do, I do need it pretty damn quick. Yeah. No, I think that's what I'm going to say. Yeah. Well, another water, water bucket thingy. And they also haven't finished this one. Oh, holy, this is bad. We have beavers here. They don't have, it, have anything to do. Two days. This is not gonna work out. Oh no. Oh no. Am I naming beavers? No, I'm not naming beavers because there is no list. Oh, wait, I should probably rotate this, right? All right, beavers, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Ay, ay, ay. I know they need materials. I do have unemployed people though, so hopefully we're getting more lumberjack flags, we get more lumberjack beavers, we get more resources, we get this done. But I don't think it's gonna happen. It is it is complex, yes, it's not just a cutesy game. It is actually a survival city builder. Oh water save, alright. Hey, what about what about we have 24, 24 hour work days? Let's go. Should have done that earlier, actually. You can do it, you can do it, you can do it. All right, two more. You cannot do it. Well, so about that. Well, one and a half dams, we might, we might be able to do this. Beavers, I believe in you. All right, last one, last one, let's go. Let's go. They're complaining because they don't get any food because I keep, I keep them working. <laughs> it's not an evil Kiri run, it's just I misplayed and now we need to make it work so that we don't die. I'm not intentionally driving them so hard. Four more logs. Three, two, one, zero. Let's go. Yes. Yeah. Okay, back to 16 hour work days. Here we go. <laughs> Holy, that was, that was scary there for a second. But hey, we're fine. We're... Oof. Oof. I actually don't want you to work here anymore. I gotta move. They're all thirsty and stuff. Oh gosh. 
Why is the dam so important? Because dry season is approaching. Forecast, Dr drought in progress. So what are you gonna see now is the, the area is drying out. I finished the dam, which means we still have water here. So we can get water for drinking. We can get, well, the, the ground is still irrigated. Not really, you know, manually irrigated, but it's still, it's still fertile. We can still grow things. The longer this lasts, obviously, the less water there will be. And eventually it's going to be going to dry out too. Oh, that was, that was very, very close. Very, very close indeed. So yeah, we've built the dam just in time. The water here is, is safe for now. Oof. <laughs> really, that was stressful. The game is dry and error. <laughs> Lovely. Does the dam ever cause flooding behind it? Um, not this one, because this one has, you know, it's, it's built that way. But I suppose you can, you can make a structure work that way. Yes. Building needs power to operate. Right. We don't have power right now because the river is no longer flowing. Yes. Yes, that's true. We can get a power wheel, though. As an emergency thing. Did I place this wrong? I did. Here, we can get a wheel. Ah, oh, all right. No good stacked here. Okay, so I can remove this. That was something. I need to go somewhere else to get more trees. Like over here, for example. So I'm going to build a path here. I like the music. It's very, it's very mysterious right now. We'll get a lumber mill, l lumberjack flag. We'll get two here and then we're going to cut the trees up here. Perfect. Where does the water flow from? It looks like it just stops. The water is coming from... From here, from outside the map, really. It's flowing here through the river bend here and it stops here now because I built the dam right and everything else also just you know mostly dried out there's a bit here still because it's so deep yeah I had I had my priorities wrong it happened it happens I wasted a couple times uh, a couple days but it's fine we also don't need this anymore Ah, the beavers have earned their rest now. Very good. Hello, Brutalist Toes. The dams affect water after the dam too. Uh, so the water stayed here for a bit, but now it's also gone. So I, I don't quite know what you mean. Thank you for the hydration reminder. Thank you. No, they don't, they don't enslave hamsters, but the beavers will run in the wheel here once we've built it, but it takes a long time and I'm actually, I'm actually out of trees here. <laughs> Too bad, really. Okay, and then birch for this. So we just need the forester, right? Once we have that, everything is going to be fine. <laughs> We're getting trees from up here though now. The badges. Can I maintain tree? So I, 
I've misplayed a bit. Um, there is technology and I got science points and put it into a forester and I wanted to build a forester here. It's been here for ages. The thing is, you need planks for that. Planks can be made in a lumber mill by slicing up logs. For that, you need power. And I didn't realize for a long time. So I, yeah. Hmm. Right now, no, but I'm working on it. We'll get this done. Then we can power this. It's going to be fine eventually. Eventually. When the Badger Nation attacked. Before it would dry all in one go. Before and after the dam. If you had multiple heights of dams, it would dry at the same rate. Okay. I'm just going to believe you. Here we go. So I need someone to work here. Yes. Look at that. Very good. This is my life now. You're doing a great job. Prayer. Prayer. -har. Yes. You're doing a great job. Okay. So here we're making planks now. <laughs> oh God. Finally. We're making planks so we can make this. Good. Well, at least we have enough food. We also have enough water for this endeavor. Um, also, the dry season is over, isn't it? Forecasts are known. I think the water is supposed to come back now. They need a union? Nah. Nah. They shouldn't need a union. Oh, yeah. I've been really mean to them. But hey, they survived. So it's fine, right? The wheel is not entertaining, no, it's just work. Yes, yes, we, we have a great dental plan. We have to have one. Metal power, what's this? A high power shaft, a windmill. <gasps> you need to this faction. I want a windmill. I feel like this is something new. Leisure. A rooftop terrace. Must be placed atop a building. Oh yeah, earlier, before the dry season came, someone was asking about if you can stack any building on any building. So the building on the ground needs to be solid. Or the building below needs to be solid. There are certain buildings, like the campfire, for example, that has to be built on the ground. But the game will tell you about this. A temple. I don't have enough points for this yet. Oh, a rooftop terrace. This looks amazing. I want to build one. Okay, we need to build up. So we'll unlock the wooden stairs and the platform. If we... Where did it go now? Oh, I want to I wanna put this here. Because then we can still stack more houses here. Okay, so we're going to build this here. Stairs. I'm going to go up like this, and then we're going to get a platform here. Oh, this is going to be so nice. The small warehouse is full. We need a new one. What's in here? Berries and carrots. That's, that's it. 250 for the bigger one. A new warehouse right there. Okay, good. Third floor, temple, terrace, though. You can do it. Yeah. I don't have enough science to to get the higher platforms yet. Also, yeah, the water's back. So this is working. We don't need this currently. Very good. I am a forester. Ah. Okay, prioritize. Prioritize. 
I'm just going to say none. You go and plant your things. We're okay. We're all alive. We made it through the first dry season. We have, what, what's this? Unconnected building. Oh yeah, yeah, of course. We need the platform and the stairs first. Good. We're okay. We're okay. So. You enjoy a lag board guy, thank you. I can't afford a temple yet. For a temple? Was that also leisure? We need 300 science points. I've got 40 currently. So I can't do that right now. All right, what else though? Fun. Yeah. Fun stuff. Okay. Spiritual stuff, aesthetics. Wow, 80 science points for a bench. It's a bit of overkill. Satisfy social life. This is also for social life. The carousel satisfies fun. I see. We're all going to have fun for a while. <laughs> Sad times. Nutrition too. Grilled potatoes. Should we get potatoes? Beehive. Bakery. A grist mill. Alright, wood. There's a forester. Okay, the gear workshop. The paper mill. Here we have it. So we need a path up here now. Oh, oh, this is cool. This is new. You need to build a path on a platform and then you get the the railing here so the beavers don't fall down, fall off. Oh, I like that. This is nice. No path to stay. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Good. Hello, Mania. Welcome back. It's going well. It's going well. I survived the first dry season. It was so close though, because um, I forgot that the forest I needs planks and I was just waiting for them to do stuff. I didn't have the means to make plan planks. So I was too late starting on that. And then I realized, oh wait, it's not going to be done in time. The dry season is going to come. I didn't have the dam finished, so I just made them work two days straight, but we finished just in time. But, but yeah, no, we're, we're okay. There's, there's, things are busy here. And now I'm looking at what I can, what I can unlock next. What is probably the best thing to get. That's a thousand points. A temple. Ground only. For 15 beavers. Maybe that would be a good thing next. Or we could get... A depth marker. Interesting. A large water tank. 120 points. I think a large water tank is a good idea. It wasn't close. <laughs> it was so close. <laughs> it stressed me out a bit, actually. It was, it was that close. A temple. You think I should get a temple? We'll see. I haven't decided yet. Landscaping. The levee. Blocks water completely, right? The floodgate. Blocks water up to an adjustable height. Oh, this is so cool. Double floodgate, triple floodgate. Explosives factory and then the dynamite. We need so much science for that though. We don't have anybody unemployed right now. Okay, building likes workers. Which one? The gatherer flag. Hmm. Yeah, okay. We don't need you right now. Do I actually have a... A hauling post? I don't think so. Haulers assist workers. I don't, I don't have that. I 
I'm gonna get this one here. I don't know if I actually have people to work this. Probably not. Or like beavers to work this. Probably not. But once we do, we get stuff done quicker. We'll be more productive as well. Uh, I mean, they might have changed this, right? Gary Love. Oh, the first one already died of old, old age. No, see, um, they're being born as well, so I don't need to allow that. Once they're in a house, they just reproduce. Well, Bara, thank you very much for the resub. Thank you for 14 months already. Hello. Welcome back. Have fun with the emotes. Who says they're married, Time Roller? Good, we are planting the trees here. Slowly, steadily. Plant, plant maple. Good. Building lax workers. Yes, you want five people to work with uh, beavers. What if we take two for starters? We don't have anybody working here. All right, so we have one beaver already working here. Very good. Okay. I know, right? It's a 16 hour workday. Um, from a human perspective, I'd say that's very rough. Maybe it's not that bad for a beaver. I don't know. Maybe that's okay for them. I don't know. So they're busy doing that. My farmers are currently not doing anything, so I think what I'm going to start is to plant a couple potatoes as well. Okay. And then I basically... Okay, I'm just going to not have this... Um, I just don't have any beavers working here if we don't need it. Because, I mean, we can only watch the plants grow, right? It's not very productive. So we're not going to do that. Uh, I hardly do 16 hours, Dab. Hardly. What I do is everything between... Let's say 9 and... 13, 14? Let's say 9 or 13 is my usual. Hey, Doom Drake. Hello. You can rename beavers, yes. It's just not easy to do that because what you have to do is you need to click on each individual beaver and then put in a new name here. I haven't found a list yet. So here it says how many beavers you have. Currently I have 10 adult ones. But there's not like a list where I can just click on all of them and rename, unfortunately. But it is possible. You just need to find them and click on all of them. I will not, Fentil. I will not. They lose two beavers. Yeah, they die of old age. So Durante and Jinjin died of old age. I hope... I hope they're gonna make more. Well, they live in houses at least, so... Let's just assume that's gonna happen. Can I be even cross a second story platform to go to the lodge behind it? Do you mean... I'm not sure what you mean. Where? The second story platform to go to the lodge behind it. Do you mean just leave this and go here? I don't think so because... Because there is a... There's a railing around it, like a fence. So I don't think they can go there. But what I could do is I could make another platform here. Make a path and then they could go here. I don't need stairs. I can just make another platform. We could do that and then put more houses up here, actually. So... Oh, the next dry season is about to approach. But I have my dam. 
we have two small water buckets full. I need any people to work here now. You need to stop for now. We need to be farmers and get our carrots. Actually, how many people are working here? Only one, one berry gatherer, but that's okay. Oh, but I do want to move the flag about here so I can we can reach those two. Food. So you're actually going to stop working. Okay. Oh yeah, dry season is approaching in two days. We are super ready for though. Okay. Eventually, I do want them to get rid of this. Like, all the tree stumps here. We don't need this. Uh, any batteries? Only the power wheel. Let's have a look at the power tab. There's a water wheel, the power wheel. Those are the shafts. High power shaft. The windmill and the large windmill. So right now there's no battery, you know. Two adult beavers per house. So three beavers can live in a house. Maybe it's always parents and one young one? I'm not sure. Maybe they're all too old to reproduce now. I don't I don't know. I hope they're gonna be okay. We will see. How many planks do we have? Also here we have carrots and berries and planks. I think what I wanna do is we wanna get a new warehouse and build this close. I'm going to build a warehouse here and this warehouse is then going to be for resources, building materials. And the warehouse is here just going to be for food. Okay. Yeah, there's no one reproducing. Yep. So far. Um, maybe we're going to die out. Could happen. I try to put a solid block on a dam piece to get a little flow through the bottom of the tall dam and have the dam act as a battery. Somehow that wasn't possible, even though the dam piece is listed as solid. So you mean you could not put something on the dam despite it being solid? Hmm. I'm not sure if I can evict the other one though. No, I can't evict them. The drought started. I don't have any unemployed beavers, but... You know, if there's someone, then I can get this, this wheel going again. But we do, we do have water. We do have lots of food as well. Okay, so... No, no, no. No berries. No bread. Carrots. Flour, grilled potatoes, no potatoes, no wheat. Okay, and this is going to be allowed, desired, default. Okay, I thought maybe there was like a category of desired food, but it doesn't seem like it. And here we want only the food. No explosives, no books. I can say empty storage. Oh god. Now, cl now click the button. Oh, that's how much there should be. Okay, okay. Well, I'm, I messed up now. That's all right. Let's do this again. I also don't see a button currently where I can save this. I can save my priorities. But I'm sure they're gonna add that. 
So I'm going to do that for the other warehouse as well. Gears. Explosives. Books. Okay. They're, they're busy. We're just going to watch them for a while. We are going to accumulate more knowledge. Currently we've got 205. Oh no, another beaver died of old age. Ah, oh, there's only nine left. There's only nine left. I mean, I could try building a new house. I don't see how that's going to change anything, to be honest. But sure. We'll get a house here. Two more platforms. And then a path here. No, there is a kid. There is a kid now. Okay, so we're not going to die out. Whew. Whew. No, don't need more houses. We're fine. Hi, Ashley. They're super cute, aren't they? Yeah. Let me make this a bit slower so that we can actually appreciate those cute beavers running around. It's especially nice at night when they just hang out around the campfire. The new house might help, yes. We planted the trees, almost all of them. It, it will be okay. We're gonna survive here. Good. Um, we have food. Very good. We have water. We're not getting any more logs currently. I'm gonna do this here. Not that I have people because my beavers just... Ah. They die. They die of old age. We'll get there again. They do have a campfire and a sunroof, yes, for socializing. They don't have anything for fun activities right now, but I think I'm going to get them a temple. Also, we're harvesting potatoes right now. So if we go to food and then grill. Can I put this on top here? Oh, yeah. I love this. Should we put the grill on top of the warehouse? Oh, wait here. Looking at the beavers around the campfire. Okay. Let's rotate. No, don't. Don't leave us. Okay, never mind. Anybody else joining? Yes. So cute. Ah, oh, the big hamster wheels, right? I mean, we have one. Good. The trees in the back are dry, that is correct, yes, because it's a dry season currently. And the water that we've got collected here only reaches so far. But once the dry season is over, which is going to be in 0.2 days, 0.1 day, then it's going to flow here again and the area around it will be, will be fertile again. So all of that is fine. We need a grill. I would love for that to be up here. If I were to get this up here, we need way up here as well. So I need one platform to start with. And then I need stairs. Okay, no, this is this is not the way to go. This, on the other hand, works perfectly. Because then we can do it like this. And it'd be already connected to the road here. I love that you can build work vertically. That is super nice. Next goal, dam up the river so all trees may live. But we have a dam. We, we have a dam. 
I mean, I suppose I could, I could build a dam here in the back, but I would need a higher one for this. I don't have that yet. I could, I could get it. Oh, that's true. I could get it. Leisure. The temple, 300 points. Okay, so like in two days, we're probably going to have that. Good. Have a, have a good time, Todd. Thank you for being here today. Appreciate it. Enjoy the rest of your day. Yes, yes, yes. So here in landscaping. Oh, sorry, that's a floodgate. It is a floodgate. Is it solid? Is a floodgate solid? Like, could I... How does it work? How does it work? So there is... There's one... One height of dam. There's one height of a levee. Which blocks, blocks water completely. And then there's three different heights of floodgates. So maybe I can just put the, the levees there and stack them and then put a dam on top of that. Or just put a flat floodgate on top of it. Controls the flow, right. Hmm. They rise up when needed. I'm not sure if they rise like in the game if they do that. It replaces the dam. You can keep water flowing from above the dam. Even in the dry season. Interesting. The dry season is over. So this is working in. Good. We're about to build this. So here we prefer... Potatoes. We prefer potatoes, not that, you know, we've got that. We have two children now and another adult just died. Oh no. Ah, uh, we're working on it. Hopefully. I don't know. We do have lots and lots of food right now. It might, <laughs> it might be a bit too much actually. Hey, farmer beavers, there, there are still carrots that you can harvest. They're just sitting there. I'm not sure why. Oh, because the warehouses are full. All right, so go find different work. Hi, old Mr. Frodo. Hello. Hmm. Okay. The trees are working. We're going to have loads and loads of trees once the maples are done. The birch is here, they are just for quick logs in the meantime. We're gonna build the grill. Social life, nutrition, two, four, six. Why did this go down again? Well, we're gonna get the temple probably tomorrow. Wait, actually. I don't. Oh no, here, 120 logs, 40 planks. Okay, that's a lot. Yeah. We do have way too much food right now, yes. We could do with, could do with more beavers. If we were to get some more. We could get more housing, just, you know, that we have it. We'll get the mirrored house here. I don't know what, what to do about the rest now, but okay. They did add content, yes. So you also have districts now, for example. You have this district building and you can place more district buildings. So for example, if I wanted to, we could go down here and place another district building there and then we, c we could have another settlement and we could combine those 
with a trade route. And then apparently beavers can go back and forth between there. How high we can stack the houses? I, I would assume that there is no limit. But I don't know because once you have all the platforms, there's also metal platforms, by the way, and suspension bridges. But once you have the platforms, you can just stack a platform on upon a platform and then have stairs and just, you know, circle your way right up. Just, just way up. So, I don't know. I suppose, I suppose that works. We haven't finished this yet. Okay. Suspension bridges. Yeah. Um, there were several ones. There was a different length. Yeah, so it goes from one by one to to six by one. And you need logs, planks, and metal for that. Oh, we're not cut. We're, oh my gosh, we're not cutting any trees, guys. I'm cutting trees from here, though. All right, you go cut trees from there. What I can do, actually, is we can pause the gathering here. Okay, good. That's going to be done way quicker. Very good. I know, right? The beavers zooming around. They're so cute, aren't they? I am playing on three times speed, though, so... If we don't... This is this is just one time speed. So cute. It's a baby one. Hey, we have eleven again. Ten adults, one child. Good. Ah, oh, all right. I can get a temple. Yes. Oh, shift R is actually to rotate in the other direction. Look at that. There is a temple. Let's have this right there. I like it how it's it's basically a tree. It looks really nice. It has an entrance on the side. So it's got a path around it. That's gonna look nice. It's a Thunderdome. The Beaver Temple. Also, we. Oops, all to save. Right. Uh, we don't have a worker here. I do need a worker here, though. Two children. Okay, we're, we're, we're getting somewhere again. We're waiting for stuff to get done. You'd hang out there. Yeah, why not? Like, with a good book? Sure. Let me speak for the trees. <laughs> if the entrance of a house points into another house, does it make it a bigger house? No, that doesn't work then. They can't access that house. What do they worship in a temple? I would assume... Tr trees? The mother tree? I don't know. The world tree. Yggdrasil. Maybe it's Yggdrasil. I should, I should get a new warehouse. What? What? How? How am I going to do this? I don't have enough points for a large one. Which is really sad. I'd love to stack this, but we we do need to get up here as well, somehow. So... How am I gonna go about this? Maybe like this. For now. Okay, so the house is done already. We're now waiting for the temple to be built. 
We already have the planks here. We're waiting for the logs. Okay. Tasty tree. Just don't eat the the one that we worship, right? The great dam. Hello, Reza. Happy time zone. How are you? Hope you're good. Okay, we have seven thingy. Oh yeah, because we have the grilled potatoes. Seven well-being. So if we get the temple done, that's eight. And that will unlock the new... The new race, the Iron Teeth. Good, good, good. For now, this is it, but eventually I want to stack the warehouses on top of each other. And also, all the houses, I'm gonna do something there as well. We could have stairs maybe here. Leading up there. Well, actually, we, we have... Yeah. You think that would look nice? I do not want to waste any... I don't want to waste any any logs on that right now because we need logs for the... For the temple and we need a lot of them. Okay, the trees need a bit more. I don't have unemployed people right now. Gather a flag. Nobody's working there, right? Water pump. The power wheel. This is okay. Nobody's working in the lumber mill right now. Hmm. Three children, though. So we just need to wait for them to... to grow up. Uh, there is spirit spiritual... Wait a second. What is it? Spirituality. There you go. <laughs> so they need that in order to be happy. So we're building them a temple. It's for their well-being. I hope your headache goes away soon. Have you have you had enough to drink, Reza? I'm okay though. Thank you. Maybe. I don't I don't know what kind of religion they have. I don't know if there's any law behind that really. We can plant those trees though, but then on the other hand we also cut down those trees and we use them, so I'm not I'm not sure. Oh, oh this is perfect. We can harvest our first maple trees. They give eight logs each. Oh, that was good. Let's go, Reza. I hope you feel better soon. All right, we get lots more carrots here. Maybe after this, I'm gonna switch. I'm gonna switch two rows here to be potatoes. Once we've got that. One more adult beaver. Good. And you went to... You went to the lumber mill. Prioritize action harvesting, yes. Well, okay, we just wait then. 35 logs here already. Are you going to continue to plant those trees that I told you to plant here? No, okay, so I need to tell you that again. I see. I wish you could just set that as a default and then just say, you know, repeat this. Just continue planting those trees here until I say stop it. Ready. Hi, Quint. Hello, hello. What is skooma? If I hover over each colony milestone, I get a bonus. Nutrition 2 gives me a bonus. Nutrition too. It doesn't do anything now. Oh, it's Skyrim cocaine. I see, I see. Never played Skyrim. Um, that, that doesn't do anything now. Everyone unemployed? 
No, I don't. I don't have any unemployed. I actually need someone working. No, they're not. They're not currently active, those lumberjack thingies. But we could we could do with more people, more beavers, because then I could tell them to, you know, have... Let's have another lumberjack, for example. I will delete this, though. The gathering as well. The next dry season is approaching. We are still ready, though. But yeah, 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 no, we're still ready. I think next I really want to get the large water tank. It's going to help a lot. Hello, Presto. I am doing well, yes, thank you. How are you? We're focusing on this. It's taking a while. Well, maybe, maybe they are immediately planting. Yes. Oh, never mind. Never mind. We are immediately planting this. This is super nice. That is very good. So what I want to do then is I want to get a second lumberjack flag. And hopefully soon the children. Yes, now somebody just grew up. So if I could make this one another lumberjack, that'd be perfect. Okay, you're great. I'm glad to hear that. Okay, I want you to harvest this. But the thing is, I don't really... I don't have space in the warehouse. Yes, about that. Grilled potatoes. Okay, focus on the warehouse. Building lacks materials. It does, doesn't it? Okay, but we have two beavers working on this now. So that should be quick then. More house, more beaver. Yeah, yeah. That is true. Oh, here. Here's the... The warehouse. Once again, only for food. Okay, so now our farmers can work a bit more. Good. Houses then. I, w I want this to look nice, but also be efficient. I'm gonna get a house here, a house here. And then we'll get this one, all right. And now I need to make sure that we've got a way up here as well. So I think I'm going to start like this. Will they be done? <laughs> they're going to be done with the houses before I'm done with anything here. We have this and then I want another house. Housing. The door has to be on the left. Because then they can use this. This house as a platform to go here. You okay? You okay with it? Hey, those are the paths that we need. Um, one level down. Very good. So that's a lot more houses. The coffee was hot. Oh no. Oh no. Use them to go harvest trees on the other side. I don't need to. We have a tree farm going here now. And it works perfectly fine. Because those trees, that maple, they, you know, it takes a long time for them to grow, but then you get eight logs for them. Which is perfect. So I think I can, I can switch the, these to maple as well now. I will start to at least. 
dry season is here and you can see already it's it's starting to last longer but that's okay plant crops i want potatoes here Oh, not here. There should be carrots still. There should be potatoes. And over here we want maple as well. I'd like to queue this and just say, you know, once once you're done with this, let's make it... Let's make it potatoes afterwards. I know, I know, Kaim. So many days are coming... So many days, so many games are coming out. Absolutely. Uh, the beavers drink water. I have two small water tanks here. And and that's okay. And we can also still get water from, from the river because we have a dam. Okay. We're going to continue this tomorrow. We have lots of new houses now. Ah, look at that beaver town. It's starting to actually look like something. I like it. No, that's all right. Think like, no need to apologize. So we have those water tanks here. This is the water pump. And we continue to pump the water here because it's, you know, it's still enough. But at one point, this will dry out. Oh, oh, wait, wait, planting. Need to get ready so I don't miss this. Okay. About the trees. This is supposed to be maple. Once you cut it. Yeah, look at that. We have so many logs now. Also, the temple is done. Here we go. I just, I didn't even see that. New faction unlocked. The Iron Teeth. Your beavers are happier than ever. You have reached a new level of... Uh, a new well-being high school. It is a very cozy game. It can it can also be stressful though. So it was stressful for me earlier because I kind of misplayed. Uh, but yeah, we unlocked the new faction. So I've played about you know an hour, forty-five minutes to unlock this. I think yeah, Shelter is coming out. I'm gonna play that too. I think we're just gonna stick with the the folk tales for now so that i can show you what the game looks like a bit later and not just start over immediately but keep in mind the iron teeth are the second faction that you can play now and they have different buildings and different architecture also a different focus because the folk tales the ones that i'm playing right now they're focused on farming but yeah i did unlock them now which is quite nice. I have almost 200 signs again. What are we going to do? Ah, oh, it is a CS walk. It is, yes. Um, So Timberborn came out today, almost two hours ago. Uh, It's an early access game that's now available on Steam, on Epic and on GOG, if you're interested in that. I don't have a buy command because it's not on, on any, you know, game stores that I have. But you can... I have a this is command. Think it up. Actually, I didn't check if it's on Voidu. Might be on Voidu. But yeah, there's a this is command. And also, I am sponsored to play this game. So thank you, Mechanistry, for sponsoring. Sponsoring me, sponsoring the stream. Large water tank. Yes, yes, I want this. No kidding. This this is large. It doesn't fit here with the water tanks that I already built here. Who who builds stuff like that anyway? Why would you do that? I suppose Because I can build it like this. I'm not happy with it, but... I don't wait here. 
Could be Wes. Okay, we're getting you a tank. Growing stuff. We're getting... The log pile is full. We need a new log pile. Can I put another one up here though? Storage. Uh, there is no way to make a platform there if it's already a building. What I could do... Could I do that? Behind here... Well, I could do this. I could put one up here. Then they'd have to run up here though. It's not ideal, is it? That doesn't matter. It will look it will look nice though. I think that's gonna work. I actually don't know if this is gonna work, but I'm gonna try it. We'll see if it does. Um yeah, there's, there's no bonus right now, Fintel. At least it doesn't say that. So if you reach the well-being thing... Yeah. Oh, does it actually say round only? It does. Oh. And I can't put logs in the warehouse. Okay, never mind then. Thank you. Delete buildings. Okay, um, well, that's, that's bad. I don't have space for it. All right. I don't really like it here, but I can put it here behind our district center. Another log pile, good. Is that the lumber mill? It doesn't work. Because it's a three by three. I could build it here. Uh, if I need another one, I'm going to build that one here. Yeah, it's because I, I was growing tree, like s growing so many trees. But I like that. This is really, really good now. So I don't need this right now. What I can do, because I don't really like those tree stumps, we're gonna remove them. Mark this for demolition. Very nice. And this too. Will we see beavers in Spain? <laughs> I don't think so. I don't think so. You can't get iron... Iron wreath beavers. Teeth beavers. No, you can only have one faction in time, so... So I need to start a new playthrough now. To get those. Across the street. Yeah, but it, it wouldn't really look nice. Right there, next to where they socialize, having the log pile. I don't know. Click a beaver to see his bonuses. So, plus 50% fertility. Life expectancy. Ah. Oh. So they do have the bonus. Knowledge. How do you get knowledge, though? This is cool. Thank you. I did not know that. 145 science. Employs additional builders. Extends its range by building paths. Do you have unemployed? I have one unemployed person. Let's see. How do you get all with a monument? But monuments are super expensive. Like, I need... 
I need 1,000 science to unlock the first monument, for example. Is there a school right now? No. You could also get higher lodges. Wait, wait, inhabitant one? Small lodge that fits a single beaver. Oh, I suppose this is really cool if you don't want if you don't want to reproduce. The double lodge for six beavers. Unique to this faction. I want to I want to get this. Although we we just made so many houses. Maybe not. Oh. Bakery, the beehive. Boost the growth of nearby plants. Unique to this faction as well. That's 400 signs though. 400, okay. Well, it's maybe not, you know. The gear workshop. I could get this. Let's get started on gears. It needs power as well. Power. Good. And then you need a path, I think. We're just gonna do this. Connect it like here. Good. We're getting more carrots. I've got one unemployed beaver. We could get more berries. Could get some berries for now. Our lock stock piles. This is really nice. Now we're rolling. Now all of this is working. I like it. A bigger dam. That's totally fine now. I mean, yes, the the dry seasons will get longer and longer and longer. Oh, I actually need gears for this. I knew that, of course. I knew that. I need to start looking at things like, you know, if I want to unlock this building, what do I need for it? I actually don't think they tell you. Oh no, they do tell you. I just, I just need to look at it. So yeah, I do, I do need gears. And we're already producing them with planks. Okay. We have lots of planks though, so that's, that's all right. Good. Put them down, hope for the best, and then, you know, almost die. Been there. Been there. No, it's fine though. We Oh, I didn't I, I didn't see that there is fire in this. Isn't that a bit dangerous to have a fire in a wooden temple? It was a fun part. No, it was it was a fun part. I'm actually quite proud that we survived it. The water wheel axle is turning the opposite direction of the water wheel. Yeah. So that was also a thing of the demo already. Seems like they didn't fix it. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Living on the edge, very much so, yes. I do need storage for gear, yes, but I have this standard warehouse where I deselect all the food. So this is for everything else. This is for all the resources. So books, for example, can go here. Explosives, gears, metal blocks, paper, planks, and scrap metal. All of this can go in here. And so far, that's all fine. It, yeah, you know, physics just work works differently here. So that's okay. We're getting the materials. Okay, we're still... We're, we're producing science. What am I going to do next then? What was that? The paper mill. The printing press for books. I would assume that satisfies knowledge then. Books for knowledge, yes. Paper. 
Maybe we could go with paper production next. The scavenger flag. So metal you can get from from those structures here. From ruins. Scrap metal. We could go over there too. Chat, shall we shall we get metal next or books? The game is lucky as you beavers so you can forgive such an error. It's really funny how how some people notice it, right? And then how some people absolutely hate that tiny little detail. I would never have noticed that. But I, I remember that chat mentioned it last time already. I don't care. I really don't care. Pointy metal bits. Books, books, scrap metal, metal. Oh, I think you you you're thinking about different kind of metal. I don't mean the music. Books, knowledge is power. It is. It is. Oh. Metal, we need 250. For books, we also need 250. Well, actually, we need more, though. 400, then. Pointy metal is more power. Then books. Yeah, sorry, it's not about the music. Well, let's see. Can't get all the required materials. We're waiting for more planks. I am I'm making those though. It's just gonna take a while until we, we've got the gears that we need. Since I just got that gear factory, it will take a bit, but then once we finish that building, the large water tank, we can produce gears without needing them and then and then it's gonna be quicker next time. It, yes, that is true. You can potentially eat those books. Yes. What is metal used for? For building certain things. There's a shredder and that compresses metal scrap into blocks and that can be used for buildings. Or... Oh, the carousel, for example, needs metal blocks. <gasps> we could get decoration. I'm not going to get a bench. The monument only needs planks, uh, not planks, logs. The first one, at least. Yeah, I don't know. So for some for certain buildings, you need it. OK, a bench. What if we, whoops, auto save. What if we want to sit? It's a bit weird if we sit there, right? Maybe we want to sit here. Because why not? Maybe we Maybe we want to sit here. Or... Okay, we saw, we can't sit below a platform. Maybe we want to sit here. Oh, I just realized, wait a second. We can go mine these paths. So that our beavers can go over there. Alright, so we're going to build this. The tem temple tree has no leaves. No, because it's, it's, it's a sculpture, really. You can link the walkway on the rooftop garden. Yeah, I didn't realize that earlier, but yes, I can. So they can they can go here now. We have the potatoes. We have lots and lots of berries again. Lots of food here. Mark resources for deconstruction. Just if you know they've, we've got not, nothing else to do. Doesn't look nice. Just get rid of it then. We're still working on the gears, but we almost have it. Okay. I wish there were a way to just let more people work in a facility. But certain buildings are just made for one beaver. That's it. 
I do have two unemployed though, so I could... I could put you in the holding, holding post. Here we go. Perhaps give a bonus. They might. They might. I have a hundred signs again. Decoration. Shrub. Satisfy aesthetics within one tile. It does. And I only need logs for that. Oh, there's a roof as well. Mm -hmm. Okay. So... What if we were to get a shrub here? And the shrub here in the back. And maybe... I didn't plan this through. I didn't build this with decoration in mind. Well... That's what it is. I might want to change all of this eventually. I'm not, I don't know. I could put this up here on the top of the house. All right. Possible to pump water inland later. Yes. So eventually you can produce dynamite and with that you can landscape. So you can shape the way of the river. Yes. It is really cool. Also here, for example, is already like an inlet so if you if you open this up you can flood this with water for example and then make everything around it lush and green yeah as it works well it's not really my first playthrough but i never 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 go for decoration in games until i've played the game hundreds of hours and i'm about to be done with it or the game forces me to with, you know, this is a tutorial place, I don't know, five bushes, you know. Good. We have 21 beavers. So we're not going to die out. Beavers can swim. Yes, they can swim. So... Metal then. 250. Okay, so I need to wait for that now. Storage is full again. Maybe I should go for a large warehouse. I should go for a large warehouse. Yeah. I have two unemployed. Become a worker. Very good. That made inbreeding a problem over time. I don't think that would be an interesting game mechanic. I think that would be... That would be truly horrible. Because... I mean, yes, you can have more districts now. But it'd still be the same family, right? You can't get beavers from anywhere else. The next dry season is about to start in three days. Okay. What was this? The gatherer flag. Oh yeah, no, I didn't I didn't want this anymore actually. Because we have this one here now. Can I actually we don't need a bridge here. This is fine. This is done. Very good. Can I give you priority? High description. Prioritize. Very nice. Now they're gonna try, at least, to fill the tank before the before the dry season comes. But this is good, because then we're gonna have lots and lots of water stored. And then I'm just waiting for more science. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make another science hut. Inventor hut. Right now we don't have any beavers who can who can work there. But eventually we'll have it. Got a platform here, stairs, and then we hit the path. I'm getting this platform as well because maybe we want to go up here at some point, and then we we already have it. Good. 
My pump can't give up. Uh, I think no, no, it can. It definitely can. <laughs> and now they're all drinking. We might get a second one. We'll see. Like we can, we can fill this up again. But then obviously everybody comes here to drink, so we might. You might be right. I actually don't know how much we get from this. Is it... We had 80 earlier and then everybody started to drink. A drinking problem. I mean, it's just water, right? It's just water. How bad can it be? Maybe this is going to be okay. Yeah, no, it's it's definitely working. We're filling this up slowly. 200 signs right now. We need a bit more. Once again. Oh, here we go. Nine well-being. We're putting in the... What are they putting in the water? How? What do you mean? Yes, you can make multiple dams. I suppose I could use my... A drought started. I could use my wood for that, couldn't I? But then this goes deeper down. Let's go to landscaping. 120. But it's solid. I suppose that will work. If I if I get this and I just, you know, make a cut here. It might work. Maybe. The dry season is here now. It's gonna be there for five days. Seems like it's getting one day longer every time it happens now. That's okay though. Someone subbed. Hello. I found this on the ground. Is it yours? Uh, now it is. Yes, thank you very much, Kixkissi, for the Prime Gaming seven months. Thank you, welcome back. You have the emotes in exchange. I I found them. You want to have them? Thank you. Hi, Mudcrab. Hello. Well, thank you. Appreciate it. I was playing Humankind earlier, but now I've got a sponsor stream for Timberborn. It's a really cool post-apocalyptic survival city builder with beavers. It's really cute. But hello, it's good to see you. We're going to play more Humankind tomorrow. Look at them. Running around, carrying things on the back. That's so cute. Beaver kind is better than Humankind. <laughs> ah, beavers. They're, they're great. Like, there are so many city builders out there. There are so many survival city builders out there. Possibly Yes, it's all been done. Beavers. Beavers? This is great. They can swim, they can build dams, they have... Um, I think they call it... Lumberpunk? The the architecture of the buildings and stuff. It's so cool. I really like it. Oh, I can... We can turn this on. Somebody has to go to the beaver wheel so that we can get uh, planks and gears. And actually, is this enough? We're producing 50 with us. Oh, this is not enough. Not even close. Ah, oh, okay. We're going to get a windmill. Yes, that's logs and planks. So much for that. A windmill. Can I attach this here? Makishi, thank you very much for the Prime Gaming. Thank you for the supports. Have fun. I think it's... Yes, yeah, so it is Lumberpunk. I actually made a note. Lumberpunk. I like the idea of it. I like the waterway management. The thing is, I want to see more of that. 
that does not work. Um, cause I'm pretty sure that I'm, I'm just not thinking of how, how I can do this. There's an assign a priority button. This, this is nice. Lead building. Yes. And then we're going to put a full way power shaft here. Oh, it still doesn't work though. Never mind. Why not? Maybe it's not allowed to be close to a building. It's probably not allowed to be close to a building. Okay. I can put it here so I don't need the full way shower. That's, that's alright. Alright, let's build a windmill for the first time. Every time a beaver drops off water, it goes to the civil building before it goes back to the pump. Maybe, I mean, there's there's no schedule really. They're just supposed to work, but maybe they have a priority that, I don't know. They just focus on something else, I'm not sure. There is no wind. Is there no wind during a dry season? Generates a changeable amount of power from the wind. There is no wind currently. Uh, that's okay, but I have it. So, you know, <laughs> once there is wind, I'm prepared for that. Okay. <gasps> On a platform. That would have been super cool. Oh, here we go. It needs to rotate. Oh, that makes sense now why it didn't work out. Very nice. I like this. I will never get the scavenger flag. <laughs> this is not gonna happen. But hey, I can I can already start with path. No, we just built this anyway. Okay, a path. I'm I'm prepared for scavenging. Ooh, and then I I probably want a warehouse there, right? Small warehouse. Good. I am still online. Yes, it's gonna be a long stream today. I still have. Well, not quite two hours to go, because as I said, this is a sponsorship and they booked me for four hours after the launch. So we're, we're still here. Absolutely. Yes. We have to be on hills. No, it works. It works. I don't know if there's just more, um, more wind during the night or if it's because it's the dry season or I mean, it's it's wind, right? That doesn't have to be wind all the time. Hi, Nokinabuna. This is Timberborn, post apocalyptic survival city builder with beavers. They're really cute. It's too far from builders. Build more paths or a new district? Uh oh. I think I need to build a new district over there. Bonus carry time. Wim, thank you very much for the 100 bits. Thank you. It is bonus time. Yes. Thank you, Nexio. I am, I am. I will set the warehouse to only take metal, but it's not built yet. So I can't do this. I need to wait for it to be built and then, of course, yes. Otherwise, they can just run there and build stuff over there. Labor. I still don't have the builder's huts. Extends its range by building paths. You think I need a builder set over there? Do I really need a new district? Hmm. I'm not sure. Dropping a couple of frames here, but it should be fine. 25 adult beavers, 26 adult beavers. Yeah, they, they're going a bit crazy right now. Um. 
how does this one stand out? Okay. You have vertical buildings. So first of all, it's beavers, right? They're super cute. They're super cute. Um, they have a unique style that they call lumber punk. Um, you can build vertically. So there are solid buildings and then you can stack them on top of each other and you can make stairs and platforms. You can make suspension bridges as well. Everything is beaver, fe beaver themed. And there are different factions. So you start out with folktales. They are focused on farming. Once you reach a certain amount of well-being, and that's eight, will you unlock the next race, the Iron Teeth? I've unlocked them, but I decided not to switch over because I want to show you, you know, gameplay from further into the game and not just start over again. But basically different races give you different buildings, different architecture, and just a different focus on how you play the game. Currently what you see, it's it's a nice season, so you see the wasteland here, but where the river is... Actually, it is a nice season right now, but we just had a dry season, so the, the river is not completely back yet. But you need to build dams, you need to manage your water, because during the dry season, the river will dry out, so you need to make sure that you preserve enough water, and then also have enough food and other resources so they can survive the dry season. So it, it is very unique. Also, beavers can swim. All right, you, so you said I need to build a district. It's too far from builders. But I'm thinking if I were to build a builder's hut there, that should probably work too, right? That's not true, Derbing Dutch. That's not true. And I don't understand why people always refer to banished. It was so bad. I didn't like it, but anyway, um, Timberborn is an early access. Since a couple hours ago, and and it got a UI overhaul, a new new graphics. It's really nice. What mines look like? Um, so you can get metal from here, ruins. I'm not sure if they actually have mines, but that's it. Yeah, I need I need a, t uh, a builder hut. I think I'm gonna do that before starting a new district. I don't really don't really want to build there. I just want to get this. So that means I need to spend science points on the builder's hut, and I'm gonna put it here. Actually, I'm gonna put it here. Does that work? Auto save. I'm gonna remove this again because I'm not sure now if that only works because I put the other one in the middle. No, okay. Do I really want it there? It's fine, yeah, sure. No, let's let's do that. Okay. So we get scrap metal from the ruins and then there is another building, the Shredder, that actually uses a lot of power and that then makes scrap metal into blocks, metal blocks. Yeah. I'm going to... I'm gonna need to munch on a fruit bar now because I'm really, really hungry. While the game is playing, of course. But yeah, let's let's look at the busy beavers. If we look at food, we have lots of berries. We might need to farm a bit more, actually. So we're we're getting potatoes. We're grilling potatoes for more nutrition. I'm also growing carrots, but it seems like they're they're just eating that too quickly. So we need more farming stuff. Mm-hmm. I think you're right. We do need another water pump. 
because by now we have 28 beavers. That's quite a lot. I can't fit this here. I'm going to build a dam here so that I can fit the water pump. <laughs> okay. And then more farming. Days to grow for. Sure. More carrots. Is it a dry season? No, the river came back. Okay. So we're going to plant this and then once I've planted that, I'm going to start planting in next field. So that not, not everything gets ready at the same time. <laughs> You're googling beaver diets. So the beavers and the Sioux, I know that they always have red teeth or orange teeth really because they eat so many carrots. And here you also plant carrots, I would assume carrots? Um, grilled potatoes, probably not so much, right? Because where would a beaver in the wild get grilled potatoes from? And then the other thing is bread. I don't know about that. Overwind beavers, I don't think so. Carrots are delish. Are you sure? Are you sure? Um, I don't know. I like cooked carrots. But, that, but that's about it. I think that still doesn't work. Okay. I can fix it. I can build a warehouse here. Okay. Small warehouse. That's gonna work now. Oh, wait, that's the wrong button. So we'll get the warehouse. I, oh, I have enough points. Scavenger flag. Yes. Look at this. Perfect. I cheated. No, I didn't cheat, but I cheesed it. Definitely cheesed it. We're going to plant more gro crops. We're going to plant more carrots here. Okay. Carrot cake. I do like carrot cake. I just don't like it. Don't like raw carrots. They need to be properly cooked. Carrot muffins. I mean, that that's also good. Carrot soup. Yeah. I'm going to eat it. I'm not going to like it much, probably. Beaver teeth are orange because they have traces of iron and manganese in them. But the carrots... the carrots interesting i did not know that but then you know when i cut carrots or when i cut veggies you stain your fingers with that and it's really difficult to get it off so i just assumed that why not color the teeth with it maybe it's both could it be both just a little bit i know right carrot cake is good because it doesn't really taste like carrot ah good stuff Decoration. We'll get a shrub here, right next to the uh, the bench. Get a shrub here as well. Since there are so many people running around there all the time, just gonna shrub here too.
I really regret not, you know, leaving more space for that now. Get a trap here. Okay. Ah, a shrub up. Of course I could do that, yes. Is that actually... Oh yeah, no, that is in range still, okay. I thought maybe that's not in range of the farmer. Two workers is the maximum, okay. I have three unemployed right now. How are we, how are we getting on here? Is it... It isn't connected to any district center path. Well, that's not true. District center. Oh, you got to be kidding me. It also needs to go here. Okay. Okay, is that is that going to work? No. It's not going to work. And I thought I cheated it. Oh. Oh. I'm pretty sure I'm not going to flood it, Aaron. Okay, well, I do need a district center. This was all for nothing. Okay. Falling post. How does how does that work? How do I make a district center? It's not housing, is it? Water, food, wood, metal, power, science? No. Leisure. Monuments. Where the heck do I do this? Plants and structures. District center. Here we go. Establish a district with its own population, resources, and an isolated path, network, employs builders. I didn't want to do that. So, they need food here. But I can't grow any... Okay, okay, so this is... This is definitely more challenging than in the demo. How am I gonna do this? Is there maybe... Other ruins a bit closer to the river? Maybe on this side. Mm. Not really. Not really. Well, uh, I need more builder huts to extend the range. R the rage? The range. I mean, I have the resources. I can just try it, right? I don't. I don't think you're right. But I can try. We'll get one here. We'll see what happens. Time roller, I've done that. Yep. There's the builder's hut at the edge. Didn't didn't change it. Just just there. So I can I can build stuff here, but the path is red, so it's it's not reaching there, you know. But okay. The district gate it marks the 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 end and the beginning of one district and the other. So if you have two district posts, then, you know, where do they stop? Where do they merge, right? And then you place the gate to say, this is district A, this is district B. My favorite type of cake. I'm not really a sweet tooth, or no, I don't really have a sweet tooth. Um, I like eggnog cake with chocolate sprinkles in it. I like cheesecake. I like carrot cake. I like courgette cake. Like it's... I don't have a favorite. I don't really eat cake much. Uh, I can't move the old one. No, I'd have to... I have to just make a new one. You can't move buildings. Ruins on top of the river.
I'm gonna say this is the top of the river because this is where it comes from. Here, yeah, no, the, the ruins here. Can be flooded. The hut's too far from the housing. See, that, that, that didn't change anything. Is it too far from the housing? Who knows? Let's let's get a house and see. Do you wanna do you wanna live here? Right right across the street from the builder set. My dam? I already have a dam. You meant the bottom. Oh, okay. Uh yeah, over there. Yes. I've got a dam here. And I'm very happy with it. This is a good start. My my storage, my warehouses are just full. All of them, really. We're filling up the large, large water tank as well, which is good. Perfect. Beavers are herbivores and don't eat fish. There are people who think that they eat fish. Interesting. I didn't have cheesecake in a long time. Maybe it's time to get it again. No, there's no military gameplay in this, no. What's his name? Mm, what do you mean, Walk the Void? The game? No, it didn't change color. It was only, if I click on the Builder's Hut, then that's it. But if I click on the District, this this is still red. Didn't change it. The game is called Timberborn, if that's what you're asking about. People confuse beavers with otters. Oh, that could be. Yeah. I knew, I knew beavers are have a war. Isn't connected. Okay, so I have, I have a house here and beavers already moved in. But that's still not it. No, it, it doesn't work like that anymore. I do need a district. A new district center. Migrant population. You know, I can I can try that. It's just okay. I don't wanna. It must be separated by gate. So I need a gate first. Where do I put this? Does that go in between the path? Yes, sorry, I just, I'm, I'm gonna build this. There's the gate. Okay. District center. Boom. So, this is, this is your life now. There is nothing there. Good stuff, right? Good stuff. Okay. So I'm gonna de deconstruct this again. Put another one right there. We need to migrate people to District 2. Um, three adults migrate. Here they come. All right, now they live here. Oh, I need to mark this for... Do I need to mark this? Remaining resource. Scavenger flag. Collect scrap metal from ruins. Oh, you need to build it first, never mind. It probably works like gathering. So I would assume I don't need to mark this. And it's just gonna work, but we'll see. Okay. Okay. I think they said they need their own food source. Its own population resources and isolated path network. I think so. Yeah, yeah, I don't I don't have any food here. 
Oh no. Oh no! Okay, so I have three people here. We only need one worker. Do I need a builder right now? Not, not really, but hey, you, you go and do this. How, how am I going to get food there? Going to die. You're so going to die. Can I move, can I move food over there as well? Transport goods between warehouses went idle. Yeah, but that's only in your district. Okay, this is called, we're doomed. We're, wow. We're doomed. They will not survive this. Very south of the road. Yeah, but that's that doesn't belong to that district. Um, is a trade route something that I have to unlock? Because when I read about this, oh distribution. Here we go. I need this. Two hundred fifty. Oh no! Distributes goods to other districts. Oh no. Oh no, I don't have this yet. <laughs> huh. Huh. Do you think that's gonna work? Cheesing this with a path that goes around it? Let us try. <laughs> okay, this is this is good. This is really funny. I like it. It works. Well played. So... I need one more person. Is this done? No. Are you gonna go? It's night. You're gonna probably finish that tomorrow. But then I need one more person to actually work there. I, c I can move the bees back to the other district, but I also want, want, to, mm, want to make this work somehow. But hey, it's, you know, it's gonna work somehow. Yeah. All the rival factions that come in and destroy your dams or something. Oh no, there, there are no such, no such thing. You only have the dry season that's trying to kill you. There are no rival factions, no raids, no, you know, angry beavers or something. Everyone freeze, this is robbery. No. No. Oh gosh, they don't have water. Of course, that that's an issue still. Right. I mean... Yeah, and I've, I've done that too quickly. I've done that too quickly. We need to go back again. So here we get food. We can get water from here. I know Aaron, but I'm playing this the way I'm playing it. And if I don't want to flood the lower levels, I'm not going to flood the lower levels. That's it. It is that easy. If you want to flood the lower levels, please go to Steam and GOG Epic. Buy the game. Flood the lower levels and have fun with it. You can absolutely do that. The game allows it. Uh, I will not. That's it. Hi, Jet to Jada. How's it going? Hello. Can the central building be moved closer to the metal? I can't move buildings. I just need to rebuild them. You need water. Yeah, I'm just gonna send you all home again. Migrate population. We're gonna send all of you home. We're not ready for this yet. But, but nice try, I'd say. I wanna get the drop off point. I need both of these. Distribution post distributes goods to other districts and then I need a drop off point receives goods from other districts. So I need 500 
um, 500 science in order to get this. We're not quite there yet, but that's okay. Um, paper? Paper, anybody? Books? Maybe? Yes. Probably. It is post apocalyptic, indeed. Beavers are civil. Yeah, because, you know, they realized what we've done to the world. Actually, I don't know what the law is. I don't know why the, the world looks like it looks. But the beavers have learned to deal with it, live with it. Yeah. Would flooding the lower levels make the ground more fertile over time? I don't think so. It's just that if we look at the river, this is the same. This is the same level here. But I could, for example, build a dam over here. Because this is the same level, and then this and this is the same level. So I could flood this. And then if the water goes goes to, to the edge here, then obviously the fertile land will spread a bit more out because there's more water in the ground. So I don't think it's a over time thingy. Yeah, no, I did make migrate them. That's just this, this three here is just, I have space, I have housing for three beavers, but no, I moved them. I did move them. There's a trade mechanic between districts, yes. And I read about it, now I also figured out how it works. We need 250 science each for the distribution post, but also the drop-off point. Uh, so we need 500 science in order to make this work. Yeah, I'm not ready for this, but that's okay. In Beaverly Hills, things are looking all right. We eat mostly berries, or maybe we eat just everything else and people don't eat the berries. That's why we have so many. But yeah. Why does it say we're doomed? Oh, I named it. I named it like that because I had to create it, the uh, an own, its own district here. So this is basically a separate settlement and they need food they need water they need housing they need just everything over there and i i could cheese the food so we can get this but i can't i can't get water quickly enough and they were already very thirsty so i said you know let's just all come back and we think about this a bit more and then we'll go back there and get the scrap metal any way to make pipes or aqueducts to move water around uh, no, but there's landscaping. So, yes, you can build dams and floodgates and so on. But also you can make dynamite. For that, though, you need... You need metal. You need planks, you need gears, and you need metal. Then you can make the explosives factory. With that, you can get dynamite. And, and that dynamite, you can then lay down on the ground. And what I've used it for in the demo is... Here, for example, just explode this so that this area would fill up with water. That's what you can do. I don't need more houses. We have three unemployed people right now and nothing to do with them. So that's fine. We can, we can make a river fork. But I don't have dynamite. I need metal to get dynamite. But what I could do as I could get a water pump here, for example. And then just, you know, start that again. It should work, because I have the builder's hurt, right? So we should... It should work. Explode and fill that bowl. bowl. I mean, I don't, I'm not planning anything of the sort right now, because I don't have explosive, and it's going to take a while still until I get it. With the metal across the river, be easier to get to start a new colony. There's water and trees and food. Okay, the metal over here. I suppose so. Why don't we just get over there instead? Wow, everything looks wrong now because I, <laughs> I turned it around. 
I suppose that makes a bit more sense. So, we want a district gate on top of the dam. Then we go through here. A district center. A district center here. Let's just hug the river here. Okay. I know, right? If if I rotate the camera, it's just wah. Where where am I? What is this? Right here. There you go. Now it looks better, right? <laughs> Hello, traveler. Welcome to. We're doomed. What? Wait, you didn't tell me. Now you're also doomed. Right? This is this is basically it. They can't transport the water. We need we need certain tech for that. I don't have it. But eventually, yes, they can do that. And then it's gonna be easy, but until until then. I, I have to start over here. So I need to start over from scratch. That's a bit sad. <laughs> but it's it's okay. We will start with log, lumberjack flags. I do need to rotate though because, because the forest is in the way. Where am I going to put this? Well, it doesn't really matter right now. Okay, we'll get this. The next thing is we need water. So, how about we get a water pump and a small water tank? Wait, are you building this from the other side? Interesting, okay. Damnation, yes. Yes, District 3 can certainly be Damnation. Oops. Damnation. Okay, in the morning, I'm gonna... I'm gonna migrate a couple people. Beavers. Migrate a couple beavers here. Okay. So quickly check my email, see if it's anything important, anything related to the sponsorship, maybe. No, we're okay. Perfect. Uh, yeah, so it's it's in the night. We'll, we'll just wait. I remove the district gate. Maybe. I mean, they go here anyway. So I don't need to remove this district gate. They just they just go here and build. Okay. So now you can you can go here, right? Migrate population to damnation. Let's start with. Full beavers. So we can build this. We don't have any food though. So we need to immediately start with farming. And I'm probably gonna plant the things. Migrate back home and then once the carrots are done, we'll come back here. Suppose suppose that's what we're gonna do. Wait, let's use this for now. Oh yeah, this is this is super nice. I like that tool. Alright, damnation. 
Oh, if I if I answer like everything, then it's just a global view. I need to actually click on the district center in order to see the resources that they fought. They're busy, good. This is a bit of an issue though, because the water is is really low. Also, this is gonna dry out during during a dry season. I'll I'll have to do something about that eventually. Okay, now the water tank. Time to dam up. I know, I know. It's just I can't make it too far away because then obviously I can't reach again. So maybe, maybe here, just make a, make a dam over there. But this is, this is very deep here. Let's see. It's too far from the builder's hut. Of, of course it is. So what if we go here? Will that work? It would work, but also it'd be like... It's not going to do anything. So I need that, I think. 250, yeah, because that's too expensive. So if I get a levy and then I put a, a dam on top, for example. Oh god, you don't have anything to drink. You're also very hungry. Okay. You need to migrate back home. Go, go home. Go home. I'm going to call you in a bit. Once you've had something to drink, something to eat. Then I'm going to call you again. Ugh, make it near the bridge. What for? Yeah. So. So that goes to the ground now. I thought it already did that, actually. Maybe not. No Peter Patter, unfortunately not. The game is only available on Steam, on GOG and Epic Store. It's not on Nexus or Humble or you know, anywhere else. <gasps> You've got pizza, I'm so hungry. Mystery said he was gonna have pizza, but I'm not sure if, if that's true. Maybe he lied to me. I don't know. Wait, what? Water pump on the other side of the first dam. Oh, that's what you mean. You know, that would have been the smart thing to do. But... But that's boring. Um, Why do you always have to play with Kiri difficulty? Yeah, we're gonna do this. We will do this again. It's not what I wanted, though. We will rebuild this. If I destroy this, will I lose the two logs? Yes, I lost the two logs. That's, oh, that's all right. That's all right. We're going to build this here. We're going to build a small water tank there. You are absolutely right. This is better. That sucks. I could have left it there for later, but, but that, yeah, no, no, now it's gone. All right, lumber. Lumberjack flag. We'll get that here again. Ah, oh, it's all right, it's all right. Cure difficulty, it's been a long stream. Oh, now, now the beavers from um, Beaverly Hills are building this, at least. So I, I don't really have to take care of this. Perfect. Ah, okay. Chocolatey cereal. Nah, I'm alright. I'm alright. I hope it was good. You had pizza. You thought someone was in your home. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ah. <laughs> 
<laughs> it was just me. Sorry, Rings. Sorry that I've invaded your home. Kind of self-imposed, though. Last time you play this one, you dam the river upstream. You made a high dam, too. So do you mean you settled... You settled all the way here, then? Is that what you mean? Okay, we'll build this. It's gonna be morning. Yes. Awesome. Okay, four beavers. Oh, no, no, no. Two damnation. Alright, let's come back. With full bellies, right? Thank you. So, we're getting water now. That's a start. Right? Oh my. Good, over here then. We're gonna get the farmhouse and then we're gonna plant carrots. Loads of them. I can actually plant here despite... Despite uh, there not being a proper soil. Thank you, Nemo, for the raid. I appreciate it. I hope you had a good stream. Thank you, thank you. Welcome in, everybody. Hello. I'm Tidikiri. Usually I don't stream this late, but I've got sponsorship and also I'm enjoying this very much. So here we are. Thank you for coming over, Irish Dave. Thank you, Alex Doran. It's good to see you. Welcome, welcome. Mountain, hello. How are you? Welcome in, everybody. How was Europa Universalis? I hope you had fun. Hello. We switched over to Timberborn. That's a post-apocalyptic survival city builder with beavers. They look really cute. And I'm starting a second. Let's call it a second because the other one doesn't count. Settlement. Over here, across the river. So we've got one here already. It looks quite nice. But now we need another one. We need to get some work done here. So, so yeah, that's what we're doing. It's been nice, awesome, making great progress on the achievement hunting. I like to hear that, that's very good. What achievement are you hunting? So, you're waiting for the logs, but you still... Oh no. I didn't tell you to cut the trees, of course you're waiting then. Good. You're gonna cut the trees. You wonder if I can raise the water level by using levees and dams. I would assume so, yeah. So, what I think... Or at least what my plan is... I'm just gonna buy this now. That I want to put levees here. And then... and then dam on top. Because this is solid, right? And that, I think, should raise the water level. I can I can start trying to build this from here. Okay, wait. If I I'm just gonna try. Cause here we have the resources, right? All I need is logs. It's too far away from builders. Oh. Mm, okay. Does it work if we go here? I don't see anything. And then we go down here. And here, for example. Landscaping. It still says... Oh, because the bridge isn't done yet. Okay, let's wait for the bridge and then, then it might work. Hello, Infinity Simplex. Hi, hi. Hope you get. Empire of Man. Play as Man, the Isle, and conquer and call all the island provinces on Earth. That sounds like like a really difficult one, but I like that you also achievement hunting. That's super nice. The beavers are probably hungry. They are. They are. Yeah, I'm gonna send them back home. To Beaverly Hills, off you go. Can 
Can I set dif send different ones to damnation? Is that gonna be the same? Different ones. Okay, perfect. So you can grow stuff here then. Okay. We can get a log. Oh no, wait, it's in storage. A log pile. I'm gonna build this here. Alright. I don't have any any houses yet. Levies with dams on top work. Good. I thought so. The stairs are complete. So... Yeah, that works. Question is, can they build this? Or do I need to put stairs here as well? Or do I need to start building here, for example? I don't know. So... I'm going to wait for them to wake up. And we'll see. I can't transfer... Oh, supplies over yet because there there is a tech that is required we need oh well, that, that's not it labor we need that distribution post and we need the drop off point and both of those cost 250 science and i currently have 300 so i could buy one of those but not both it does not come with a free chevy no hi mew girl yes it's the beaver game it's timberborn i think this works it does work. Oh, this is perfect. Timberborn, the post apocalyptic survival city builder game by Mechanistry. And it's now in early access. So people can actually get it now. Exclamation mark, this is. Um, you don't know if you would like to live in a place called We're Doomed, right? That's why I don't send people over there anymore. Good. In two and a half days, there is another heat wave. Dry season. I don't have people working there. Why not? If I turn this off... Like... Are you not doing anything anymore? Do you just get home? They can just go home. All right, migrate back home. Because it's night, you're not going to work here anyway. We planted a couple carrots. Wait, all of this is going to dry out. I think we're probably going to properly start this next, next normal season, next cycle, really. The free housing, right? Free housing. But at least this is going to work. And the beavers can use all the locks that they have there here, and we have lots of them. And then we can get... Distributes goods to other districts. We can we can get this started. Oh, that looks interesting. It has a compass on top. Interesting shape for a building. Okay, we'll get this. Is it already morning? Ah, yes, Hoogie Hoogie. What's up? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Hoogie Cookie. That is very kind of you to say. Here we should be... We should be prepared for the for the dry season we have lots of food we have lots of water as well that's gonna be okay we have a bit of water over here but we just don't have any food yet we will get the food though all right in the meantime let's let's go chill with our beaver friends this one is still carrying the backpack from work. This one too. They didn't even have time to go home yet. Or maybe they didn't want to. Maybe they just immediately wanted to come and hang out with the friends. And family, potentially. 
The games I play and recommend are usually hidden gems that people wouldn't hear about if I didn't promote them. Yeah, some of them, that is true. I'm glad you like them. And you know, usually those games are also safe for people with simulation sickness. This one is, for example. But yeah, it does, doesn't it, Silent One? They sit on their tails. I, I've never seen a beaver sit, so I'm not sure if they actually do that IRL. But that would be fun to know. I just, I don't know. How much do we produce again? Not too much, but then the wind is not strong right now. Building lacks workers. Oh, I know. But if I turn that off... And this, we just basically turn all of this off. What, what's, what's this one? Because we don't have people here. It's cute how sometimes they run on four legs and sometimes on two legs. Yes. Yes, that's true. Like, if they're carrying a log, they do that on their shoulder, of running on two legs. Um, if they're not carrying anything, they might just run on four legs. Yeah. Can you still reach this, or is it... Is it over? Is that as far as you can reach? No, you can still reach it. And there they go. There they go. <laughs> oh, look at it. How can you not like this? They're so cute. Oh yeah, so they carry something here on two legs and then they run back on four legs because it's quicker. I have a path. The reason why it didn't work is because um, if they don't have a blueprint for this, they can't reach that here at the bottom. So you need to build this and then you can build the next one at the, at the lower level, higher level, lower, and so on. They can sit, you googled it. Hi pa Paco, hello. Thanks for coming over. So they actually sit on their, on their tail, with the tail here between, between the legs. That was... <laughs> ah, so cute. Storms relented. You have sunshine now. It is so crazy when you say that. Because here it's already pitch black again outside. No, absolutely. You you get some sunlight, Bjorn, but thank you for being here today. Appreciate it. You don't like it. Oh, that's that's okay. Of course you don't have to like it. I think it's super cute. The dry season is gonna start, which means someone subs all to save. Okay, we'll just <laughs> all right, all right. Apaco, thank you very much for the brand new sub. Appreciate the support. Thank you, thank you. Have fun with the emotes. Enjoy. Thank you. Oh, hooky hooky. No links. Also. To everybody, because as a subscriber, you're allowed to post links in here if it's, you know, within reason and it's about what, something we're talking about. But even as a subscriber, please never just post any links. Always say, you know, I can imagine this is a beaver sitting on, on like, just sitting, right? So then you'd say, hey, this is a beaver sitting link. And for everybody else, do not click random links on the internet. Especially if there's no description to it. Be careful. Here we go. The drought started. It's five days now. There you go. Hey, this is a beaver city. See? See? There you go. Oh, great. By November, you regret any missing chance of chasing the sun. Of course, of course. No, I get that, Bjorn. You go. You go and get some sun. Oh wait, here. Sometimes I'm like, like where, where's the river? Where did it go? But I just need to unselect things. Yep, it's starting to rot, dry up. So our uh, um, motor wheel is not working anymore. Just okay. We've got a beaver running here in the beaver wheel. Here's the 
distribution post. And we have workers there. I can assign a new route. I don't have the the second thing yet, so we're gonna need to wait like two, three more days to get the signs required. We're willing this here though, so that's good. Okay. <laughs> oh Reza, oh Reza. The beaver's almost folded itself into a ball. I'm gonna. The thing is, if I click on this, the game is going to minimize, so I'm not, I'm not gonna. But feel free to post the sitting beaver in the Discord, so I can look at it later. <laughs> I think, I think I have to look this up later then. Yeah, so this, this is dried out completely now. Yeah, what's to be expected, of course. This is still alright. What about... Yeah, of course, this is dried out, so nothing's growing here. It's drying out and it will die in 1.7 days. Fine. Fine, that's okay. But yeah, we basically need to get this going before the next dry season happens. You want to eat beaver tail? Fentil, no! Can you actually do that? Why? Why would you do that? I know, you can now say, why would you eat cow? Why would you eat pig? I don't know. I don't know. Why? Get a snack. I know, I'm, I'm hungry. But, but we're still doing the sponsorship. So I'm, I'm going to be fine. We need to grow here. Are you, are you not growing here? It's because we're finishing harvesting everything. I think for the... For the harvesting period, we need a second farmhouse here. We currently have four unemployed people. That would be the four that we send out to the other, to the other district, right? No, it's fine. Mystery's, mystery's playing games. Oh, beaver tail is actually not a beaver tail. Oh, I'm relieved. Also, I think we now that you mention it, we might have talked about this when I was playing the demo. Maybe. Oh yeah, it's pastry. That's okay then. Hi, Anna G. Yes, Timberborn. Timberborn, because now it's out. It's in early access. You can actually play it now as well if you wanted to. Exclamation mark. This is. Um, it's really cool. They've redesigned the UI, they made the beavers cuter, they also breathe now, so it doesn't look like they're dead at night. Um, what else? You can play the second faction, the Iron Teeth. I've unlocked them, but I didn't start with them yet, but we, we need to do that still, right? And yeah, lots of changes, good things, I like it. Check it out if you're interested. Perfect, Fentil. Yeah. Yeah, I think I remember that. But like the first, the first second of you eating beaver tail is like, wh why? Why would you do that? I remember. A cursed looking beavers in the Discord. Okay. Well, at least the beavers here are not cursed. They look super, super cute. We have. Only berries. I don't think they like berries. Or they just prefer everything else first. Prioritize... Potato. But we'll see, now that they can't harvest that now... Oh yeah, now they're gonna grow potato. Okay, so it's... The prioritizing of the type of vegetable is for harvesting and then and then sowing. Good to know. Good to know. Okay, we're gonna start with the carrots. Are you also working here? Yes. Very good. Perfect. Apparently pizza pasta, apparently, yes. There's been a lot of changes indeed. Yeah, so it it looks 
It looks cleaner. The UI is really nicely done. I like this. And then... I don't have any beavers sleeping... Sleeping on the ground now, but just... If you look at the beavers, they, they're just... More refined now. Also, you have new buildings. You have the new faction that you can play that also has unique buildings to it. It also has different architecture. And you have the districts. And then you can make a new district and have trading routes. And I'm working on that. Actually, actually, <gasps> actually, I can get it. So, labor, the drop off point. I want to build this here close by. So that hopefully. Oh, I don't even need to build this. Never mind. This is great. I can I can put this somewhere else then. I thought we might need to build this, but no, I just put it there. The drop off point. I want to have this right where. The... Hello. Yes, please. I'm so hungry. Oh, I'm getting a snack. We'll put this here. Perfect. Ha. Ah. Yes, but it says what it is. Hookie cookie. It says what it is. It is a mystery and mystery is going to bring me some food. So trade routes. How does that work? Routes. Add a new route. Select a drop off point. Select goods. Well. Berries. To damnation. Uh, I couldn't select how many. Okay. Well, you just wait and see and we soon we're not going to have any berries anymore. Let's see if that's going to work at all. I'm not I'm not sure. I'm not convinced yet. Okay, more carrots here. Because we have lots of beavers already. We have 32. Way to feed them somehow. Ah, the eyes are coming first. I don't think so. I don't think so. Well, not, not now at least. We're continuing our work here. Which is good. We're using up our logs. Or at least we're using them. We are putting berries here now. We already have a hundred. I hope you stop at some point. I don't I don't know. But this is good. Snow so I'm recording my voice lines next week already. It got it got moved forward. So next week, Wednesday and Thursday I'm gonna record them. And then supposedly it doesn't take long to put them in the game. There are no enemies in the game. Your enemy is the sun and the dry season. But there's no no real enemy that you've got to fight. The Insta post. Uh, about... Did I post something? Voice lines? What did I post? I don't remember. But yeah, so next week. Next week. There's not going to be a stream on Wednesday. And Thursday is going to be a bit later than usual. Alright. Well, we're busy doing our things here. I do have unemployed people still. Beavers. So there's really, really no need to move them away here. You're okay. Good. 1.2 more days for the dry dry season and then we're gonna migrate a couple beavers again to the damnation district so that they can grow stuff from over there okay good enough thank you it's okay oh, it's fine <laughs> oh later i don't know do you still want pizza more pizza it is come on Ha, ha, ha.
Reza just did the applause command. Yes, so we're gonna get pizza later. <laughs> Our pizza place doesn't do a stuffed crust. I got a small tomato. I love those. And I got a... It's a radish, right? Mmm. You can totally flood the whole map. Okay, actually, I don't, I don't know if you can flood the whole thing, but you can do some flooding. You'd have to do that here, though, right? I mean, basically, I'm gonna, I'm gonna flood this a bit. Am I not eating it as much? Sorry. Yeah, it's very crunchy, isn't it? Mhm. Mm There you go. I saved you from the eating ASMR. And then I just realized, wait, I do need a path up here on that dam. So now they can reach further still. Good. Yeah, I had I had one radish. Because Mystery, when he brings me a snack for streaming, he brings me a variety of things and then I can pick and choose. So it was one tomato, it was one radish. Um, now there's another uh, cereal fruit bar and chocolate. But I don't really feel that right now, so I just went with the veggies. I love snacking on veggies, it's so good. Yes, this is the default map. This is the one that you could also play in the demo, but there's loads more to choose from. I just thought I went with the recommended one. The drought has ended. <laughs> mystery, mystery just called the pizza place. And they once again, they they know what kind of piece I want because it's so weird. Okay. Migrate. Damnation. Four adults. Let's go. They come here. And then they're going to grow stuff. Hopefully. The water is going to gonna flood back into the valley. Okay, hello Ronan. Yes, a nighttime stream. I've, I've still got half an hour because Timberborn, the game that I'm playing right now, released today as an early access game. You might have seen me play this already several times actually during the alpha because there was a demo available. But now it's an early access and this is a sponsor stream. I'm being paid to play this game for you right starting with the launch for four hours. So we're still playing it for a bit longer. If you're interested in the game, please let me know or exclamation mark this is to get more information. You can't look serious when eating, nor when the mic picks up the crunchy sound. Of course not. Of course not. When do I ever look serious? Well, when I'm mad usually, but that's that's about it. <laughs> um, what, what is on my pizza? Okay. So, there you go. Um, pepperoni. Onions, sheep cheese, there's the river again by the way, olives, what is on my pizza? No. I mean I don't mind garlic but it's usually not on it. Pepperoni, onion, pineapple, I forgot pineapple, of course, okay pepperoni, onion, Pineapple, sheep, cheese, and olives. And if there's garlic on it, that's even better. It doesn't go pizza, yeah. I, li <laughs> I like it too, but I don't know. The restaurant thinks it's really weird. I don't. I don't know why. <laughs> yeah, all right. I think it's a perfect mix. 
we need we need a forestry a forester i'm gonna try to cheese this i need a forester if i build it here maybe we can build it from you know from the other district i'm not sure if that works that would be nice we do get lots of berries here. Okay, what about in Beaverly Hills? We still have berries, but we don't have a lot of food. Because we have so many... So many beavers. Boost the growth. Oh yeah, that's a, that's a beehive. What about you? Wheat into flour. Makes bread. One wheat and point one log for five bread. So obviously that'd be good to make. Good to make. Beaverly Hills, yes, chat came up with that. It's perfect. No, I don't, Mephistopheles. I don't. I did because chat chat came up with it. I was asking for a beaver pun to name the district, and then it was Beaverly Hills. It's perfect, doesn't it? It's so good. <laughs> nice mania. And I'm really looking forward to the pizza. Okay, we're hosting carrots again, so hopefully that's gonna that's gonna help us for a bit. Wheat production though. Um wait, what about irrigation? Irrigates land around it. I don't have signs. I just clicked it. I don't have signs points for this. I need 200. Oh, I need one more. I could totally get the irrigation tower. And then what? And then I could... Oh, it's probably a bit far away. Oh god, you're going to starve over there because you have to go so far. Poor beaver. Can we still reach this? Yes. put a logs here the beavers are sleeping outside beavers are sleeping outside here we should probably get a house a mini lodge double lodge <gasps> let's get this the six beavers yes yes i'm sure i i said no ah oh, nice oh but the entrance is on the in the in the first floor I was not expecting this, but it's still okay. Oh, Reza! Oh no, you were just testing it, right? If it's still there. It's still there. Okay, we need stairs going up here. There's going up here. And then we can put a shrubbery here. For that house, we need 20 logs. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Just testing, right? Just testing. Sure. Yes. What existing game is the, is the closest to this one? Um... There are other survival city builders out there. I don't know any game that has beavers in it. I don't know any game where you have to work with water regulation. So... Other city builders where you've got technology, where you can build, but... Here you can also build vertically, right? So it's a city builder, it's a survival city builder. You need to manage your resources, but also vertical building and um, water regulation. I don't, I don't know. I haven't played any games with this, you know. I don't know. <laughs> oh, have a good time, uh, Pizza Pata. Thanks for being here. Enjoy playing.
You're disappointed that there are no default explosives. You just need to wait, work your way to the explosives. The 3D building idea. Yeah, so we've we've built a nice little house here. Apartment complex, really. With a terrace. And then we've got a pathway over here across the building. It's super nice. And obviously you can build way higher up as well. It's really cool. Yeah, but see, these guidelines is completely different then. Because it's not a survival game. Here it actually is. Because you have dry seasons every now and then. And then you need to... You need to survive those. Okay, I wanted... I wanted irrigation, but now I bought something else. Classic. Classic. I can still get started, though. Because what I wanted was... Up here. Let's say... Where is it? Cut trees. Um, I wanted to put an irrigation tower here, grow some wheat, and then start the bread manufacturing. No frost punk is more difficult than this one. If we was found a nation, will there be damnation? Well, this is damnation. Yeah. You pr prefer the explosive version of irrigation to building a tower version. Yeah, that, yeah, no, that makes sense. Also, this worked. This worked. This is perfect. We have a forester here, so... I need I need more people here. At least 3. Migrate population to damnation. 3 adults coming right up. Okay. No, that's okay. I don't expect you to be here all the time and then remember things or even read stuff because also that might be super small for you. Totally okay, but we have Beaverly Hills and then I made another district called We're Doomed because then I realized, oh wait, I don't have the tech yet that allows me to actually move stuff from one district to the next. I abandoned that very quickly and then we made Damnation here because we need to build a dam. So yeah, dam Damnation over here. Over here. And I'm getting somewhere. It's, it's you know, taking a long time, but at least we can take the resources from our main district. Home's in a new district. I'm working on it. I think it's just that, oh, oh, this was paused. I was not working on it because the district building was paused, so nobody was working. But there it is now. In Damnation, we have 100 food. Okay, so that should be... That should be good enough. Ah, Hollywood is near Beverly Hill. I like it. <laughs> of course, Snarford. If you have any other questions or, you know, beaver puns, just share with us. We're growing our very own carrots. I do need a warehouse here still. Don't have a warehouse yet. Maybe I'm gonna put this here in the back because then ev eventually I can also stack them. Good. What are the dam's purpose besides being a bridge? All water and dry season. Yes, exactly. So here, if I g if I g usually I'm always in the built menu, but if I'm outside the built menu, you can actually see the river. So if we zoom in here. This is the river. I built a dam here, so water can still throw f flow through it. Holy, I just thought my monitor was broken, but no, that was just a pixel glitching through the water. Um, the water can still flow, but once the dry season arrives, uh, there will not be any fresh water coming from the top of the river. So what happens then is 
we keep a certain amount of water here in that area yep up until until here um and then we can use so use that we can still pump water from there the water mill the, the water wheel is not gonna work though because there's no flow anymore but we can save that and now this is way lower so if there's a dry season and the water just stops you know the water is gonna flow out of here and that's it so what i'm trying to do here now is very slowly build a dam on a high level so that i can keep the water in here as well so that i can keep growing um plants here in the dry season do you know what a beaver's favorite snack is wood chips i like it perfect ah well that beaver vertical expansions be vertical expansions to the dams i mean but you can do that you can stack it on top of each other right do they require maintenance that's actually a really good question no currently i'm gonna say currently because the game just came out as an early access game so things will change right but currently there is no maintenance for nothing not for the dams not for anything i can imagine that at some point that's going to be added especially for the dams but right now no no maintenance madame oh ronan you've got lots of beaver beaver puns perfect building on the dams you can do that i've done that here with a second water pump i've done that can you see this yes a bit so i pulled <laughs> i built two dams here so that I could fit the, the pump in here. Yeah. Because it's solid, so you can totally build on it. How are things here? We do need more food. All right, so we're going to prepare this. Irrigation, 200. It's not ideal if I built this here, but it's... why can't I not build this here? Must be built on the ground. Oh, a tree is blocking it. Okay, I want to build it here, so this tree needs to go. Delete. All right, demolition, I suppose. If nobody's gonna, you know, do this, but... <laughs> we have so many logs. Also, this warehouse is full. We need a new warehouse. Um, I think what I'm gonna do is we'll build platforms here. And then I'm gonna... All right, I want a large warehouse, but I still don't have it. A new warehouse. But then I have to... No, no, no that's alright, that's alright. Because I can I can put the, the uh, thingy here. Stair. Stairs. Words? What? We could also put a shrubbery here. Put a shrubbery here. Make this look a bit nicer. Build road and remove instead. I could do that. I could have done it, but it's, you know, it's already done. Here we go. Irrigation. And then I need a new farming house here. Farmhouse. I'm gonna add this here. And the beavers are on the way. Oh, I need... Damn. We can still reach this. This is really... It's really impressive. We can still reach this. Ah, true shrubberies with a path down in the middle. Where would that go? 
I mean, yes, I could, right? I could make another shrubbery here. And the path could go here on a raised platform, 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 and stairs that way. But no. That will increase the way they have to they have to walk to get there. So no, this is this is alright. Okay. We've built this. This is now irrigated. Yes. Very good. So if, if nobody is actually... Oh, oh, you don't reach this. That's why. Get the lumberjack flag. This is high priority. I don't have any unemployed. We're going to pause this down here. I do want to make this into maple as well, but it kind of... It doesn't happen. It just doesn't happen. Okay. Good. Yeah, the uh, Timber Timberborn game is currently 10% off during launch. So, if you're interested, now would be a good time to get it. Or if you want to wait, because you might not want to get an, an early access game, and then consider wishlisting it if you haven't yet. Oh, of course, you get more beavers, I need more houses. Do I want more beavers? Not really, because I don't have too much food right now. Oh, I need... Wait, I thought I already assigned this. No, I already assigned it. I need a working beaver to come here and do the thing. You're not doing the thing. Distribution post. Yeah, let's only have two. We still don't have anybody here. Lumberjack flag, irrig irrigation tower. There's nobody working in the grill either. Okay, maybe we need it. What if we get the double lodge house? And we put it... How am I gonna go up another floor here? We could go around here. I'm just gonna do that now. Because, because why not? Housing then. Infinite beavers. Well, we need food for all those beavers though. I can just do this. Oh, I knew that, of course. Yeah, because this is the only entryway. Okay, there it is. Easy fix. Oh. The two two story houses can go in water. That that makes sense actually. Oh, this is really cool. That is so good. I like that. Hello, Grey Fox. Yeah, a bit. A bit for sponsorship. Yes. Ah, I lose the water tiles. I, yeah, but still, like, if, if you plan to flood everything, that's a really good option. Oh, yeah, I kind of... Oopsie. I kind of forgot that we're not growing anything here. So we want to plant maple trees. Mm. Here in the back, I suppose. We don't need too many, do we? If, if we plant this, maple trees... You're gonna be busy. We'll get carrots. Wait here, damnation. We do have carrots. I'm still gonna transfer the... We never finished this. We need planks for this. You have a go about that. We don't have planks here. We need... 
Oh no, they've been sleeping on the floor this whole time. We're not ready for that yet. We'll get that though. Okay, hi Alpha, how are you? Hello, hello. Thank you for listening, Noral. Have a good evening. Okay, so we still don't have anybody working there. Happens. Happens. Uh, Transfer them. Wait, now is the question, why are the people there? This guy. They're here because of the ruins. They don't, they don't need to sleep inside a house. They can just sleep, right? Okay, and then we have, we have stairs here. Okay. If I want to get scrap. It's gonna work. It's gonna work. And a warehouse. Right? A warehouse for scrap. Maybe... Right there. Oh, this is going to be good. And then we can get the metal. Then we can move the metal to the other thingy. Yeah, because we don't have gears here. We don't have planks here. If I want... Oh no. If I want a distribution post, we do need planks here. So I do need the same thing here with uh, electricity. And the lumber mill. I mean, that makes sense. But okay. They don't need a home at all. No, they, they... I mean, they really don't. They really don't need a home. We will sleep indoors. They even have dens. I know. I know. No, that actually means it's full. The building is full. That's what it means. But yeah, they, they don't have a home. They just sleep on the floor outside. Yes. I know, right? They, they've improved the graphics so, so much. It's really incredible because this is only a team of seven people. It's really impressive. Oh, that's what you mean. Of course I can send the planks. Why did I not think about this? Why am... Wow. Add a new route. Planks. I can't say how many. So right now they're just going to bring a couple planks. But that's okay. So we're going to bring a couple planks. Then we can finish this. We do need a couple more people here though. But yeah, once, once we finish this, then they can procreate here. We're going to remove the tree stumps. We don't need those. And we're going to plant... Plant more maple. Here they come. Those are the planks. Very nice. Do you know how old beavers get? Hello, Neutronity. It is unusual streaming time, yes, but I'm streaming for sponsorship. The game launched at 5 p.m. And they booked me for four hours, so yeah, of course. It's a good game, and I mean, getting gaming sponsorships is always nice. So absolutely, absolutely. 24 planks. All right, this is fine. So we're going to kill that trading route again. This is really nice. And then the metal. I could also bring over gears, more planks and gears. To get the shredder. Oh, we'll see. 
Is there an overarching story or is it just a building city sim style? Right now there is no story, but this just dropped as an early access game. So I'm not sure if it will get a story. I'm really not in a position to say that, but it's brand new, early access game. It is a survival city builder. So currently it's only about um, experience the game, try out how it works, but also increase the well-being of your beavers and with that unlock a different race so there will be more races currently there is the first one the folk tales that you start with and then if you have eight well-being then you unlock the next one the iron teeth and they work differently so first of all they look different but then also the buildings look different they have different buildings and a different play style because the first the first beaver race that you play with they're focused on farming and the Iron Teeth are focused on um, machines, technology. They breed differently. I haven't tried them yet. I wanted to advance a bit further into the game because it took about 1 hour 45 minutes-ish to unlock the Iron Teeth. And I didn't want to start over immediately. I want you to see, you know, just gameplay, more gameplay. They have cloning baths. Oh, that's really cool. I didn't, I haven't watched the trailer. Yeah, they think about metals and wheels, apparently, yes. Are we doing okay up here? I saw them. <laughs> so still nobody's doing this. All right. Hurling post. There's only have two people working here. In the district center. Although I do need those builders. The farmhouse. Okay, nobody's working here right now. Finally, okay, finally I've got someone working here. So I can take this. And then we're gonna plant wheat. How long does that take? 10 days. All right, let's go. We're waiting for the trees to be gone. This is all going to be wheat that will be put where actually? Because we then need mill and we need a bakery. How do we do this? Oh yeah, sure, sure. Maybe we can fit that here for the production. So we might want to get a warehouse. I'm going to get a warehouse up here looking this way. Because then with pathways or just platforms platforms i mean we could go here all right then then we could get a mill and the bakery here that should work out thank you for the hydration reminder all right that was the dam coming along Steadily. I don't think we're going to finish this until the next dry season. But it's a start. Yeah, so that was the third farmhouse. They weren't planting anything because I wanted to get rid of the trees first. But yes. It is here. It would be nice to regulate the area of effect of the irrigation tower. Have like a slider there. Or maybe like a one, two, three levels of irrigation. All right. Oh, next year, that's all really fun. The cloning baths use berries, making reforesting berries relevant for them. Yeah, that's cool. I like that. Beavers in the wild can live up to 16 years. Females become sexually active at two and a half years. 
Okay, thank you for looking that up. My beaver's um, 49 years old. They're very old. <laughs> Although, okay, okay, wait. That might be just be cycles, right? That might not be years. That might just be cycles. And not years. I say years, but the game actually doesn't say that. That's funny, though. 49 days. Do you think it's days? That could be it. It could be days as well. Yeah. All right. Lots of new beavers are being born. Died of old age, but I can't click on them anymore. So I can't check how old they were when they died. That would have been interesting to know. Can't live in the zoo for 20 years. All right. Hey, cool. Thank you. Days for born and grown up. That is true. It's mentioning the cycle and the day. So it's it's cycle dash day. Yeah. Okay. I've got nobody to do this. Can you not reach it, maybe? Do, do I not have people to? No, you, you should be doing this. I'm glad they're not dying here. This is really nice. Also, the, the forest guy is planting trees. What about... Oh, next dry season is arriving in three days. We haven't built this here. Is it too far away? Not really. I just don't have any builders. Oh, you are buildings. It's just going to take a long time. We can have someone migrate again. One adult to damnation. Mystery is home with a pizza. Okay. So. We've done well. We've unlocked the Iron Teeth, the second faction. Second beaver faction that you can play in this in this early access game right now. There will be more though. I'm working on more river manipulation. I've got irrigation here now. Actually quite happy with this. And up here we'll see. Up here I'm growing wheat so that we can start our bread production. Because we want bread. <laughs> Must be hungry, right? Well, he ordered it so that it would be done by nine. So I already went to pick it up. Three more trees. Those two then. Once they're gone, we can also get rid of the lumber thingy down here. Very nice. Maybe getting a third inventor's heart would be good. He also taking this one, sure. I'm going to turn those on again because I'm actually like working through all my all my trees down here. It's quite it's quite good. We had so much earlier. I mean, there's still way more that we can get, but the, that dam is taking a lot of our resources, which is fine because we have it, right? So why not use it? But yeah, so this is Beaverly Hills here. Here we go. People at Hills with a new dry season coming up. Chat, I hope you enjoyed this. Timberborn, new early access survival city builder game with beavers. You can build vertically, you can regulate the river. You need to survive dry seasons, manage your resources, the food. It has... It has a new UI. It looks very clean, very polished now. It had a graphics update as well, so the beavers are even cuter than before. If you can believe it. Where's it busy right now? Where can we where can we go to to watch people? Watch beavers. Maybe go here. I don't really know. Lots of new buildings, lots of changes. Uh districts are a thing now, and you can actually make trade routes between those districts and have fun. Hi Elandristan, sorry about this, but I'm just ending. 
I've, I've done overtime for a sponsored stream. A sponsored stream for Timberborn. Um, exclamation mark list says, if you're interested in getting the game, it is available on Steam, on Rio G, on Epic now. As on Ali Access game, as I said. And I'm super excited about it. Like, this is brilliant. I love it. I played the demos before, but now I can see the changes. They've done well. It's a small team of seven. I I enjoy it. I hope you liked it too. So check out the game, wishlist it if you're interested in it, if you don't want to purchase it right now, but it's currently 10% off for its release. Thank you, Mechanistry, for sponsoring that stream. I had a lot, a lot of fun. And chat, if you want to see this again, we could definitely play this again and maybe check out the Iron Teeth faction that we unlocked, the other Bieber faction. I'm glad you had fun, that's great. Hi, Raywin. Hello, hello. Oh no, Eli Dresden, please take care of yourself, all right? We're gonna call this... Actually, I should have left the date. Um, it's the 15th. Folk Tales. Save the game. Perfect. Hey, Sean, hey, thank you. Thank you very much. from Twitch for so long, I even forgot to spend my prime somewhere hash S-H-A-M-E. Oh no! Oh no! Thank you very much for spending your prime here now. Not letting it go to waste, that'd be a shame. Thank you. It's very kind of you. So, everybody. Um, it's time for me to leave now. I'll be back tomorrow, same time as today, 2pm CST. We're gonna start with Humankind, and then maybe we're gonna switch over to, to play some more Timberborn if you're interested. The surprise that I have planned for tomorrow is not gonna happen because it got delayed, but the surprise is gonna be there is no surprise. It sucks. But I'm streaming tomorrow, so I hope, I hope you'll be there. Thank you, all of you. Unfortunately, the music ends, because the music is really nice, but yeah, when I click out of the game, that's, that's it then. All right. Thank you all. Thank you for the support, for the bits and the subs and the gift subs for purchasing games through my Nexus store. I appreciate that a lot. Thank you. Timberborn is not available on my store, not on Humble, but as I said, it's on Steam Tube Epic. I do have an Epic Crazy tag, but yeah. Thank you all. Have a good evening. Enjoy your the rest of your day. I'll be back tomorrow and now I'm going to have pizza. Good pizza with pineapple, as it should be. Thank you all. I appreciate you. Have a good night. Take care.